Um, so, uh, and uh, for the Echuca side, uh, Andrew Walker, of course, ex-Carlton AFL player and um, co-coach, has uh, sustained a hamstring injury, so uh, he will not be uh, playing straight here, unfortunately, okay. for the uh, small crowd in attendance. In the middle of the ground, the umpire throws the ball aloft. Uh, Brown wins the ruck uh, contest uh, for Mansfield, but Darby Henderson gets the clearance for Echuca, and they're already at centre-half forward. Left foot kick oh, comes dang. in from... Uh, Number 62 there, Sam Willoughby. But uh -huh. uh, it uh, fades across the uh, goal mouth, bounces once and pitches out of bounds. In the uh, left forward pocket, uh, Echuca uh, kicking uh, to the Memorial Gate end of the ground and a beautiful day here in Mansfield. Mm. Oh, yeah, fantastic. Um, uh, the breeze is blowing right in our faces through the window here. So uh, Echuca go forward. Uh, the big ruck in there, number eight. Kane Morris has a snap on goal and it's through for a point. So the first score on the Henry III scoreboard goes to the Tuca Murray Bombers. And they are one behind. So uh, doing the kick in uh, duties for Mansfield. Looks like Taz Clingham down there, Taz. I'd say. Uh, in the absence of quite a few defenders, Taz has had to go back and play it virtually at fullback. He comes out long looking for Brown at half back. He flicks the ball over the top of the contest, but there's no Mansfield player there. Achuka go back inside, attacking 50, number 25, with a centering kick. It's mopped up down there by Mansfield. And a handball comes out to Jamie Sheen. He's got a running player. Uh, going past and Klingon. Klingon brings under the right boot, goes straight into the middle of the ground, looking for Brown. He's got two against him. The ball hits the deck, and uh, Chuka defend uh, stoutly there through Jack O'Kelligan. He heads towards the boundary line. It doesn't go out of bounds. They've got it centre wing, member side of the ground. Good tackling pressure there from the Eagles. They get the ball on the deck, but there's plenty of Chuka players there. Hamill comes out, out Mansfield way. Brown over the top. Running player goes past there. Mm. Gardner flies out of handball, but there's no one to receive it. And the big Ruckman gets a Chuka moving forward again. And uh, number 62, left footer. Uh, Willoughby drives them into attacking 50. It's out wide. Jack O'Grady leading in the race for the Eagles. Escorts the ball over the boundary line. Just uh, right on the 50 as uh, in the left half forward flank for the Chuka Bombers. So interesting start to the game. Uh, the uh, Mansfield coaches implored the players to provide effort and to uh, develop good habits as uh, he gets the ruck tap out and Bartlett drives oh, yeah. the ball towards the centre wing but uh, there's plenty of Echuca players there little kick into the middle uh, from Valentine hits the target and the mark is taken by Henderson inside the centre square virtually directly in the middle of the ground he looks back out to the press box uh, side Luke McKenna coming up marks it at half back he goes forward inside 50 coming out there defending O'Grady quick kick goes forward again it's in the goal square. Oh, well done by that Echuca mm. player, but nice mother Smother of the Eagles. Yet. And a shot on goal from Willis there, uh, who has kicked 25 goals this year. And uh, he's smothered and across for another behind to Echuca. Indeed, they are now two behinds and Mansfield yet to score. And uh, the score is brought to you this uh, today by Henry III and he's your local liquid race specialist. Haven't seen Tony today. No. He only uh, does the umpire escort duties, but uh, we haven't seen him as yet. Klingon comes in from full back. He goes long, looking for Bartlett. The ball's uh, on the deck there. Echuca arrive in numbers. Good tackling again from the Eagles. That time Will Foster. And we'll get a ball up. Defensive half back. Uh, right in front of the can bar there. The uh, locals enjoying the wintry sunshine out there. Uh, neither Ruckman touched the ball. It's on the deck. Chuka just forced the ball towards 50. Uh, Jamie Sheehan battling hard there. Gets a left foot kick down the line. And uh, no one can take the mark. It's Mansfield go oh, forward through Marnie. His kick goes to half four, but there's no one home. <laughs> and it's going to trickle out of bounds. It does. So that's a good kick for touch there from Brett well, Marnie. that's right. Yeah, that's going to be a good rugby uh, <laughs> yes. ploy, wouldn't it, that one? Yeah, well, the, the part of the plan for the uh, Mansfield side was to try and compress the ground up a bit and uh, stop the free-flowing Echuca midfielders having such a big impact and uh, switching the ball all the time. So, yeah, well done to the Eagles. They're following the coach's instructions early. Yeah, I was going to say, the, the game is pretty well free flowing at the moment. I mean, both uh, sides are, you know, there's no scrambly play no. and everything, so... Chuka right. have got the ball on the centre wing. Kick goes uh, forward from Wheeler. Oh. Uh, Howes there under the pump there, battling hard at centre-half back for the Eagles. He uh, goes over the top of a Chuka player that doesn't give away the free kick. That Sam Willoughby looks like he can... Uh, he, he'll be in, in everything, I think. The he's he's certainly started, started. started uh, very well for a Chuka, mm. getting plenty of the ball. So uh, the Chuka Ruckman there taps it out. Uh, Kane Morris, tackle applied immediately to uh, 
the uh, midfielder they're going towards goal and another ball up. Brown comes down to do the ruck contest. He goes backwards, but uh, there's no eagle there to get it. Chuka fire the ball out the back of the uh, pack. Mm. A little kick comes forward. It's going into the pocket and uh, cling them there to uh, knock it over the boundary line uh, up against Corey Gregg and we'll get a boundary throw in about uh, 40 metres around from the Echuca goal, left half forward flank Memorial Gate end of the rec reserve back they go, Brown gets the ruck tap out goes to Bartlett, Bartlett handball looking for Marnie, misses him uh, Foster there applying the uh, pressure for the Eagles gets a little left foot kick towards centre half back yeah, good mark. and a uh, nice mark there in uh, front of Jimmy Herridge has been taken uh, by number 20 Corey, Corey Gregg, Gregg. Yeah. he goes to full forward and uh, too easy mm. uncontested there virtually at full forward a mark has been taken by the big fellow with the red boots not sure who it is at the moment. He's the big fellow with the red boots. <laughs> <laughs> Number five, uh, Willis. Five, there we go. It'll be yeah. Daniel Willis. Okay. And uh, the, the, the boots are exactly the same colour as the Sharon. They so are too. Colour coordinated. Oh, yes. He's got the mark 40 metres out, uh, 30 metres out really. Not much angle to speak of. Uh, just a little bit right of centre on his approach now. So he's crossed the 50, little stutter step, and his kick is on the way, and a goal umpire just looks skywood. Pretty good. And puts up the two fingers. So the first goal on the board to Daniel Willis. Correct. And uh, the scores now. Mansfield yet to score. Ichuka, one goal to eight points. And the scoreboard to you by Henry III, and as Henry says, he is the wizard of ooze. He is. He certainly is. He certainly is. So uh, thanks to Tony for being involved uh, as the scoreboard sponsor here on Radio Mansfield. Back in the middle of the ground, the umpire getting ready to throw the ball aloft. And uh, it uh, will be Brown in the ruck for you. He's got a height advantage, Brown. He taps it down for Marnie. But it's uh, Shark by, Sh uh, by uh, Wheeler. Goes deep into the left forward pocket. O'Grady back there for the Eagles. Picks it up. Just uh, sneaks away from a chasing... Uh, player, lovely kick out to Foster who slips over at half back, but he takes the mark first, so Will Foster's got the ball, and uh, playing a little bit further up the ground this week, he goes back, almost a full back to Clingham, so patient play from the Eagles, they've got a lot of tall timber out there, so they're going to have to uh, share the ball around and run it out of defence, kick comes out to Lockie Williams in the back pocket, he's got the orange boots on so uh, just defending slowly here the Eagles, he's Bites off a kick up the middle, looking for Gardner, who flies at centre half back, marks the ball in the sunshine. Gardner now looks short towards the wing, and he finds Jamie Sheehan leading up. Sheehan's got a player running out wide. That'll be Foster, I think. Left foot kick goes forward to half forward. Brown working hard has got all the way up there to uh, almost attacking 50. So okay. he escorted it over, so yeah. that was all right. Yes. This is up that way. That's right. It's in the right area. It's in the right area of the ground. So uh, we're 65 metres around from the Mansfield goal. Left half forward flank near the netball courts. Here goes Brown again with the tap out. And uh, Marnie. straight to Marnie. Marnie goes uh, at goal. Oh, gee, and is that almost, almost, almost went through for a goal. But Did not miss by much One at all. point on the board. First score of the day for Mansfield. Correct. And uh, they are now one point. And the Chuka Bombers, uh, one goal, one a one goal two, I should say. So uh, all players pushing up in one half of the ground here. So Echuca will have to do a little bit of slingshot footy. They come out to the halfback flank. Watson <laughs> flying Mr. from behind. <laughs> and uh, back there first, Lockie Williams for Mansfield. And uh, he fumbles the ball over the boundary line right in front of the super box here. And uh, the umpire will throw it in. So centre wing. And uh, the players all push over to this side of the ground. In the rack wardle for Achuka. But oh, Brown yeah. taps it down to Marnie. Marnie goes straight to full forward. And Howes is down there for Mansfield. Gets one hand on it. And Selmy onto the loose ball. Fires out a handball. Can't get a mm. shot. A quick shot of goal uh, is, in fact, has been taken and gone through for a uh, behind. That was Anselmi, wasn't it? Yeah. Uh, I think it was Guy Murray with the actual oh, okay. kick on yep. ball there. Guy Murray got the blue boots on. And they come back quickly from full back at Juca, and good mark has been taken by Mitchell Kemp. He plays on immediately. We've got running players going past centre wing. Uh, Henderson goes towards half forward. Uh, Mansfield players getting back there defending. Bartlett gets uh, dragged off the ball. Rika's fighting for the ball, has uh, one arm pinned, so he can't dispose of it. And uh, we get a ball up 
inside the centre square, virtually the middle of the ground. And uh, Jamie Sheen in the ruck for Mansfield uh, almost uh, drew a free kick from the uh, ruckman. No one touched the ball at the contest. They just forced the ball forward at Chuka. They're at centre half forward. Oh, uh, Chuka player know. picked the ball up and dropped it. Yep. And, yeah, mm. unlucky there. Free kick going to Cade Morris at centre half mm. forward. Or is it Wheeler? I think it's the big fella number eight. Eight, yeah. Yeah, that's Cain Morris. Morris. Yeah, he's kicked a behind uh, already. A little bit unlucky there, Ryan Bartley. He, uh, he grabbed that, the ball, and uh, unfortunately yeah, the umpire says, no, you've got to come back around behind the mark. I don't think he trusts his own. He's <laughs> kicking. Uh. Uh, Wheeler <laughs> trying to get a free shot at goal here. That's right. So uh, Morris is uh, coming in from 50, right on the 50. He's left, his right foot drop punt is on the way, and I think it's hit the post. Yeah. Oh, one that's behind. That's yes, that's it did. Yeah, OK. So another point on the board uh, to Achuka. OK, so he's now Achuka 1-3 to Mansfield 2 behind. So uh, Clingham get, doing a lot of work back there defensively. He runs out of the goal square, goes long towards half-back. Oh, yes. oh, big, big fly fight. from the Chuka player. He didn't take the mark, but that recovers for Mansfield. And uh, they force it around to the wing with a chain of handballs, the Eagles. But uh, breaks down centre wing position. Kick uh, comes inside from the Ruckman. Now a Chuka can go right full four. There's three on one down there. And uh, Jack O'Grady comes out of def the defence square. Oh, nice tackle there by uh, Rikers, yep. and he's been rewarded. It uh, looked like a certain goal uh, for Coming Pachuca, up, yeah. but uh, Rikers got across in uh, support, applied a good tackle against Willis, and earned the free kick. He goes out looking for Sheehan. He's at the back of the pack. He uh, forces the ball over the boundary line. So uh, still, Pachuca's attacking 50, right half forward flank. Small crowd in attendance. Not much joy for the Eagles so far to speak of in the lower grades, Paul, unfortunately. No, no I'll give the scores shortly. And boundary umpire tosses it back in. And uh, the ball is on the deck. Looks like Anselmi firing at a handball. and uh, But it's chopped off centre wing. Echuca flick it around there. And uh, Wheeler almost got a kick away, but he's tackled. So uh, it's a bit scrambly there now. Mm. It's uh, 60, 70 metres from goal. And look at Marnie, oh, yeah. just forces his way out of the pack. Oh, has great. a bounce, has a second bounce. He's in the middle of the ground. Handball over the top to Gardner. Gardner on his right boot, kicks it towards full forward. Andy Brown. Oh, yes. His market at centre half forward, a bit too far out to score. Goes back inside the centre square, just slowing it down a little. Uh, his kick is off the oh. side of the boot. And uh, Echuca fumble it at uh, centre half forward. Plenty of Mansfield players over there, but uh, they can't get a handle on it. The umpire's paid a free kick. It's going Two away, the Eagles. Mm. And it uh, looks like, is it Lawton? No, he's heading back towards the no. goal square. It looks like Gardner, number 30. Yeah, Tom, Tom Gardner. Tom Gardner's got a fr drawn a free kick. He's uh, man on the mark. Oops. He's uh, 35 metres out. There's no angle to speak of. Uh, so Gardner here with a good chance to get the Eagles' first goal. Need some tall timber in the uh, goal square just in case it does drop short, though. Yes, I'm just having a look Rick to see, Brown. see who's gone down there. Gardner has uh, crossed the 50 on his approach. And his kick is on the way now. It's high. It's a little bit left to target. And the umpire slaps himself on the shoulder and says, mm. one behind. OK, so another behind to Mansfield. And at the 12-minute mark of the first quarter, we see Mansfield three behinds. Trailing the Chuka, one goal, three. So uh, six points of difference there. Kick comes in from full-back. Brown, best oh, place for the mark from the Eagles, but he's dropped it. Uh, Watson, with a little kick off the ground, goes looking for Williams. He overruns the ball. Jimmy Herridge gets back and uh, fires it out to Clingham. Clingham goes to centre half four. There's no tall oh, timber there. Sheehan nearly a mark. Ball's on the deck, pushed off at Marnie. And uh, battling hard in there. The Eagles trying to get a uh, clear player. But uh, no doing good defensive skills from the Echuca side. And uh, we will get a ball up. Josh Marton in the ruck. He slaps the ball forward. But uh, there's only Echuca players out there. And uh, Mitchell Kemp fires the ball high towards the uh, halfback flank. The ball is uh, bouncing all over the place out there. Handball comes Echuca's way to Henderson on the wing. He goes to full forward looking for Will Willis. And uh, he picks uh, the loose ball up now, fires out a handball. The Eagles have got back there well to defend. Uh, still in a dangerous spot, and uh, they can't get a handle on it. And finally, do the Eagles get out of trouble? Yes, Marnie, playing a good game. He takes two or three of them on. The umpire says that's OK. Play on. Kick on goal. Ooh, has hit the post. 
by the big fella there, number eight yep. in Kane Morris. So another point on the board. <laughs> What's his third? What's his third behind for the, uh, <laughs> for the game? So he's, he's getting, uh, getting get, plenty of shots. Get the ball in his hands, I say. Yeah. <laughs> Keep passing it to him. <laughs> he's the one that doesn't like kicking from a distance out, I don't think. Kick, short kick comes into the back pocket and uh, O'Grady marks for the Eagles, shielding the sun from his eyes. He goes looking for Lawton, who's come up from 4-4 to get a touch. He marks 50 metres uh, from the defensive goal. Goes straight into the middle for Gardner, but the kick's got a little bit too much carry on it. He uh, works well to get oh, back on it, tries to get it out to Foster. Yeah, he's uh, uh, he's yeah. been pushed in the back, gets a free kick. So Gardner, middle of the ground for the Eagles. He looks out wide, centre wing position. And uh, I think that's Howes out there, it is. He goes towards half forward. Foster there for Mansfield, gets the ball on the deck. And he's got tackled without it, forcing the ball forward again. Will Foster, well played. Bounces off a couple of opponents, but yeah. uh, he's forced over the boundary line. About 40 metres out from goal. And uh, the Eagles are uh, at left half forward. One four. Is four in the big road netball, fellows. Yes, mate. The is 66 and Mansfield 37. Oh, uh, well. B-grade, was it? Yep. Marton directs the ball down out of the ruck contest. And uh, Mansfield battling hard in there, trying to get a clearance. And ball gets to the back of the contest, fired out again. Uh, and a good tackling there by, I imagine that's Lawton down there at full forward. And uh, we're going to get a ball up uh, 20 metres out directly in front. In a little bit of strife, getting uh, some assistance there from his teammate. He's up, his jaw. up and about. Andy Brown's drifted down there as well in the ruck. And uh, he taps it towards goal, but uh, no, uh, it comes bounces back to him. He fires out a handball, but uh, very sc scrappy play. Sheehan backs out of the pack, but he couldn't get a kick away. Achuka flick it around finally, and a kick comes out of defensive 50. Mark taken at half back uh, by Darby Henderson. Echuca look to square the ball now. They're still in defensive 50. The kick comes towards centre half back. Rikers does a good job for Mansfield with a spoil. And uh, ball falls to Marnie. Left foot kick is smothered off the boot. And uh, keeping the pressure on uh, here are Echuca. Well done again. Jimmy Herridge getting a, a spoil in, but they finally force the ball out at Chuka. They're at centre wing, right in front of the press box. Happy to uh, escort the ball over the boundary line is Noah Wheeler. Uh, so centre wing. Right in front of the new electronic scoreboard here. And a tight contest. Just um, Mansfield had plenty of uh, time in forward half, just not able to yeah, capitalise capitalize on, on it. it. Yeah, Marton in the ruck uh, goes looking for Marnie. He's tackled immediately and uh, not getting out of uh, Tim Allen's grip. So we'll get a, another ball up. And uh, Joby Wardle, Wardy, he uh, fires out a little... Ruck yeah, tap, yeah. and uh, the umpire has paid a free kick to the Eagles here yeah. for a legal disposal. Clingham wants to take advantage, but uh, nothing doing. And uh, Jack McHale, the free kick is paid against him. Goes to Josh Marton, who uh, gives the ball short down to Rickers. Yep. Centre wing, he looks into the middle. Clingham has marked the ball on the edge of the centre square. So we're just going sideways here to Mansfield side. Just about all, player, Brown, all Brown. players are in one end of the ground. He Brown's goes looking for Andy for Brown. Ah. But uh, getting back there is the opposing Ruckman. He's in the hole and takes the mark in front of Andy Brown. And uh, Ward comes to the centre wing. Big fly there. Unable to complete the mark. Chuka player flicks the handball out. Bartlett there battling hard for the Eagles. He's uh, tackled by Kane Morris. And uh, a ball up will ensue centre wing. And uh, umpire tosses the ball up now. Josh Marton taps it down. But uh, on the fly there coming through there, Tim Allen almost got away with it. And uh, the ball centre wing. He gets a kick at it this time. He uh, kicks it along the boundary line. Trickle over the boundary line, 55 metres from the Echuca goal. Left half forward. 18-minute mark of the first quarter. Mansfield trailing by seven points. Chuka won 4 10, Mansfield 3 points. In quarter time in the AFL game this afternoon, it's uh, Fremantle uh, 25, Melbourne 13. Come on, the D's. Boundary umpire tosses the ball back into play. Right on the 50, Marton in the ruck, flicks the ball out the back looking for Anselmi, but he couldn't get it. The Chuka player is uh, going right. to get a free kick for yeah. contact below the knees. And uh, number 46 it is, Barber. Cooper Barber. Cooper up. Barber. Cooper Barber. Cooper Barber. Uh, so he's got it left half forward, 55 minutes right. from goal. He's got a lead on into the pocket, but uh, oh, getting across nicely there. Bartlett uh, takes the mark for the Eagles. He looks across the face of goal, and Howes is in the uh, full-back position. 
So, uh, very dangerous kick, but well executed. Howes goes looking for Clingham and uh, should be front on contact there, you would think, and he'll get a free kick. So, uh, 50 metres from uh, the defensive goal. Well done, the Eagles defending patiently here, looking for an option. Imagine he'll go long. He tried to, but he's uh, the stopped the kick. One. And it bounces along the ground and it trickles mm. over the boundary line. Uh, just defensive side of the centre wing. Right in front of the coach's box there. Crew on the interchange bench. And the trainers look on. Uh, no one no one went for the ball in the ruck contest. Josh Martin backs up, picks it up. Uh, he's tackled immediately. The umpire says, I'll ball it up. Point off the centre square. So 70 metres around from the Echuca goal. And uh, here comes Rossi Brown Rossi through the Brown. pack. Lovely little handball, frees up Sheehan. Sheehan goes on the left boot, kicking the middle of Brown. Brown's got a running player, and he goes to Murray. Guy Murray goes to centre-half forward. There's no one at home, but uh, Gardner comes up uh, out of uh, the forward pocket. Plenty of Echuca players back there to defend, and McKenna has kicked it straight back to Jamie Sheehan. 65 metres from goal. Jamie Sheehan plays on, looks into the pocket. And Lawton there. Oh, yep. And he couldn't quite hang on to it there. He got rid of his opponent. Ball's on the deck. And uh, Mansfield battling hard there, uh, just inside attacking 50. Left half forward, and the ball goes over the boundary line. That was a shame, because uh, I think Lawton could have had a, you know, a yeah. ping at that, and I think he would have dobbed it the way he's been kicking this year. He's been, uh, he has. Of course, he's the leading goal kicker for the Eagles with 42 goals this season. That's terrific, isn't it? Uh, the uh, ruck uh, uh, favours Jamie Sheehan, but uh, he couldn't get a handle on the ball, and uh, big pack of players have forced a ball up. So uh, 50 metres from the Eagles' goal, left half forward. Netball uh, caught end of the rec reserve. Lawton, ball's bouncing around in there, and uh, Tim Allen involved, but uh, there's no way to get out of that big pack of players over there at the moment. Everyone's pushed up again following the coach's instructions. Uh, and you could try to get out of their defensive 50 but there's plenty of Mansfield players around the ball and it's fired around. Finally a little kick comes forward but uh, Achuka player playing in uh, front there at full back takes the mark. He's got a teammate on in the back pocket so they've switched it across to the press box side of the ground. Kick goes back into the middle Brown there for Mansfield. We'll get the ball and uh, drive it inside. No, it's a good smother. So the ball's back in the middle of the ground. Clingham goes to ground trying to get a kick. Uh, Watson fires out a handball to Brown. Brown's handball is chopped off. He gets a little touch on it, tries to get it going forward. And a good tackling from the Mansfield side. And Selmy straight through. His handball misses the target. They go back inside. Oh, nice oh, tackle. Yeah, Clingham, right? Clingham with yeah. a good job there. Uh, gets his uh, Chuka player on the deck. Doesn't get the free though. No, I think it might have been Jack McHale. McHale. Brown. <laughs> oh, the Ruckman just locked up anyway. Uh, Jamie Sheen having a good quarter. Fires out a handball. Watson with uh, a handball out wide. He's bowled over after he disposed of it. Corey Gregg gets the ball going forward for Echuca. And uh, it's uh, in the uh, pocket. Here he is, Willis, number five. Right foot snap across the shoulder. He's long. Bartlett there for Mansfield. He's yeah, taken a mark. A very good mark in the uh, back pocket. Plays on immediately to Marnie. Marnie comes out uh, to Rikers. Almost centre wing on the press box side of the ground. Little left foot kick into the middle. has got a lot of heat on it. Sheehan takes the mark, though. Plays on to Anselmi. Anselmi runs through the centre square. His kick goes to half forward looking for Lawton. But uh, no mark taken. And Big Andy Brown. Brown lumbers onto it. Handles it out to Guy Murray. Murray goes out. Rossi to Brown. Rossi Brown, left foot kick, lovely kick. Rossi Brown on Lawton, oh. stopped it at uh, centre half forward. And uh, he's tackled, no free kick, says the umpire. A golden opportunity slips away there and uh, coming out to Noah Wheeler. Well done, Echuca. They uh, defended well there and uh, they get the ball attacking side of centre wing. Lockie Williams picks it up for the Eagles. Gets around one player, goes to Rossi Brown. His handball goes back. Oh, a player tackled yeah. there without the ball. Looked like, looked like it, but uh, no free kicks as the umpire. He's letting, uh, the letting go. Very he? willing stuff here from both teams. Mm. Uh, they're looking a bit tired already as the, uh, we <laughs> wind down to quarter time. Yeah. Uh, a throw up. Centre wing, member side of the ground. Brown. Ward. Both of them have a slap at it. The ball goes a Chuka's way. Marnie there can't pick it up, and it goes over the boundary line. About 80 metres around. I'm finding when he's throwing the ball in here too, 
it's not very high. Not, not very it's high. Not going very high. Which they don't, is a bit of an they don't get a chance to uh, jump at it, do they, Paul? No, not at all. Anyway, not, yeah, that, not fair it, on the that is the siren for quarter time, folks. Uh, Chuka, 1 4, 10 2, Mansfield 3 behind. That's very good to see. And uh, back in the middle of the ground, the umpire getting ready to uh, kick things off. The uh, Achuka players were held in their huddle a little bit longer than the Mansfield boys. So yeah. perhaps trying to work out what's going on, why they can't get their free-flowing style of footy going. But uh, well done to the Eagles, defending stoutly. Umpire holds the ball aloft. There goes the siren to kick us off. Second quarter. Brown in the ruck against Wardle. Goes looking for Sheen, who's dragged off it without... It, uh, they get the ball slightly towards the centre wing of Chuka. And the ball is forced out towards the members' side of the ground. Lots of tackling, lots of numbers around the ball. Already there's uh, 16 or 18 players around the contest. And the umpire's got no option but to ball it up. Centre wing. Members' side. Brown directs the ball down. To, uh, no one can get a clearance as yet. Plenty of players throwing themselves in, and, uh, Very including uh, Noah, Noah Wheeler and uh, Brett Marnie, Rossi Brown there. So uh, umpire will throw it up. That's a bit better. That's a little bit higher. Yep. And uh, again, a lot of players around the ball. It'll be tough to get it out of there. And the umpire circling will ball it yeah. up. So three in a row we're hitting four, plus the one in the middle. So that's uh, four bounces. <laughs> in about uh, yeah, one minute. In, in about a minute. <laughs> Uh, Brown appealing for a free kick. Nothing doing, says the umpire. Toss it up, he says, so he yeah, does. Right. Brown gets the front position, taps the ball out. Foster kicks the ball forward from Mansfield. And Selmy is out yeah, there mark. by Cam Valentine at halfback. He comes towards centre-half back. Heritage chasing hard there for and the Eagles. Applies him. a good yes. tackle. Ooh. No free kick. Yeah, Bit unlucky. They fire the ball out uh, to uh, Henderson, who goes to uh, half Wheeler. forward. And no, uh, Wheeler. Wheeler has yep. uh, marked the ball right in front of the super box here. Right half for flank. Two kicks from goal. And uh, his little left foot kick goes down the line. The goal umpire blindsided says, that's OK, it's a mark. So Lanyon has got it. Still out for outside attacking 50. His kick goes towards centre half forward. We're down there, camped under it for Mansfield. Doesn't take the mark, a ball on the deck. Bartlett fires out a handball looking for... Ooh, oh, nice. nice tackling there from Howes. They force it towards the yeah, boundary line Mansfield now. Marnie's got it. He's got no one to give it to, so he goes back to Klingon. Klingon goes, just bums it on the boot and comes along out here. But Peter Fawkes is marked for Ichuka. He goes around the man on the mark. Got a player on loose at half forward. Uh, 55 from goal and Darby Henderson it is. Marks kicks towards full forward. Lockie Williams flies from behind and uh, forces it through for a behind. Okay. So uh, first score of the second quarter goes the way of the Yachuka Murray Bombers. And it's his score now 1-5. Yachuka to three points Mansfield. So it looks like Jamie Sheen's gone down to full back to do some kicking in. He runs into the uh, pocket and then uh, goes long to half back, but uh, no one can take the mark. The Chuka fire the ball around at half forward. Uh, a nice little blind turn out of trouble there by number 22. He has a flying shot on goal. It's not a bad looking And I reckon he's seen. gobbed it. So great goal there to Luke McKenna. Luke McKenna yeah. okay. Lovely goal, first goal of the second quarter. So that leaves uh, Mansfield there, 14 points behind, uh, trailing Ichuka. Ichuka 2 5 17 to Mansfield, three behinds. And the score is brought to you by Henry III uh, once again. And uh, Henry III, he's a proud sponsor of Radio Mansfield. And if you want to get your pipes pumped, <laughs> give, <laughs> give Tony a buzz on 0418 515 596. And not today, though. No, not today, no. no. Not, not today. Saturday is his day of rest. That's right. So uh, he'll turn up and look after your uh, tank there for you. So uh, thanks again, Tone. In the middle, Wardle uh, taps it out. Under the loose ball goes Rikers. He handballs over the top. Howes handball to uh, Sheehan. Sheehan goes to Stefanuti. Stefanuti's kick goes towards full forward. Uh, not easy to mark. Lawton has a bit of a fumble in the pocket oh, again. Over. And uh, bowled over. A Chuka defend well. They come to half back. Almost centre wing now on the, uh, the, mem uh, the press box side of the ground. Nice pick up. And uh, they flick the ball around by hand at Chuka. There was no handball that time, umpire. Rossi Brown fighting no. hard. Andy Brown for. Mansfield as well, but Achuka finally get clear. They go to half forward. It's one-on-one uh, -on -one battles. Jack O'Grady onto the loose ball for the Eagles. He leaves it behind. 
Uh, Lucky Williams is uh, back in, back there helping him, but uh, will they get it over the boundary line? Yes, they do. They force it out in the right uh, back, uh, the right forward pocket for the Achuka side. Achuka attacking to the netball end. Brown running down to do the ruck duties. And in the throw comes from the boundary umpire. Directed towards the back of the pack. Klingon there. Tackled without the ball. Uh, Rossi Brown. Rossi Brown's got it now. Uh, he's tackled and the ball spills out. The umpire says no disposal. Oh, <laughs> and uh, a little bit unlucky there. Rossi Brown free kick paid at right half forward. It's um, Noah Willer. To Noah Wheeler. Wheeler. Mm. So uh, Rossi Brown stands the mark 40 metres out. It's uh, probably 30 degree angle. Sure so run up to it from, uh, he's come all the way back to the wing virtually. So uh, just a little bit of breeze in his face. Beautiful day here in Mansfield. Noah Wheeler. Kick is on the way from 52 metres. It's across the face. Brown will uh, tap it over the, yep. the line for a point. So another point on the board to, to Ichuka. Ichuka now 2 6 18, Mansfield 3 behinds. Quick kick ca comes in and is marked by uh, Jaden Howes. He goes looking for Will Foster, but uh, Chuka spore from behind. Oh, gee. High tackle yeah. there uh, has uh, been paid against Rossi Brown. And uh, it is Noah Wheeler again. He goes uh, into full four. Big fly there. No mark taken onto the loose ball. And Chuka Rover is bowled over as he kicks it. And it goes through for a point. Hmm. What a time, netball fellows. This right. Percy Chuka, 10, and Mansell, 15. Oh, well done, okay, girls. That's all right. Yeah, OK. And uh, that score went uh, to uh, Sam Willby, Will who yeah. uh, was uh, very lively in the first quarter, Paul. He was indeed. Uh, he was looking uh, looking the goods, wasn't he? He certainly was. T touches in the first five minutes. Yeah. yeah. Four. So she and this time... Drop punt, looking for Bartlett, who uh, couldn't complete the mark, but he taps the ball over the back of the pack and over the boundary line for a throw-in. So, saw um, uh, Joel Sanford uh, before the match today, and uh, he's in the moon, not the moon boot, but the uh, the leg. Oh, the knee brace. Knee brace, yes. a whole lot. Yes, and I feel for the poor lad. He's yeah. uh, got the old... Got a long way to go. His meniscus is not uh, behaving. <laughs> so he's going to be out of action for about six months, I think. Yeah, he, he will be. Uh, Clingham defending here for the Eagles. Goes onto his left boot. High kick. Goes up in the air. Yeah, and a right. uh, nice mark taken there by uh, the Ruckman in Job Wardle. Or Ward, actually, it is. Hmm. His kick goes into the pocket. And uh, Bartlett marks for the Eagles. Playing a good game back there, Ryan Bartlett. So he's marked it in the uh, back pocket. And uh, he's got Brown on long. That's the way he comes. Ward up against him. Big oh, fly from behind mark. by uh, Valentine playing a good game. And he's marked it. Right in front of the super box here. About 80 metres from goal. Very tall side of Chuka And mm. uh, making uh, use of their aerial prowess there. He goes long to full forward. And uh, again, Bartlett marks for Mansfield. He fires the ball out to Howes. Howes is running from the back pocket. He goes towards the member's side of the ground. He's got a player on out there, and uh, they flip the ball around the Eagles. Bennett goes towards uh, the centre wing. Mark Ross taken Brown. by Ross Brown, member side of the ground. And uh, attacking, uh, they go uh, stay on that side. Kick goes forward. Little handball off to Marnie running past. He goes to 55. Lovely, lovely looking. Oh, oh that was stiff. It's the <laughs> left post <laughs> rush. Oh, uh, point Lordy. on the board to the Eagles. Oh, nice play, Brett Marnie. Cannot take a trip. Echuca comes straight back from full back. They've got the mark at, uh, <laughs> inside the centre square. Here they go. They've got their running game oh, going now. Uh, Tim Allen misses the uh, mark at uh, half forward. Oh, that's very clever, <laughs> clever play there. <laughs> yep. Kick off the ground goes to Kane Morris, who's marked 35 out directly in front. Well, he's got three behind so far. I wonder if he can uh, do the honours this time. I wonder if he'll see someone running past him. He's hoping so, I think. So uh, his kick Close. is uh, on the way now. Right foot. Uh, it's going a little bit left. And oh, uh, yeah. it's another point. His uh, arms are up in exasperation there, yeah. Paul. Oh, well, well, well. So, so I think they're going to have to look after him a bit, I think. <laughs> Run past him when they see him with the ball. Don't let him kick it. So at uh, full back, uh, the crowd... Get the ball back over the fence and uh, 
Jamie Sheehan will kick in. Clingham gives him a little lead out wide, but he ignores that. And uh, now he spots him out there on his own, and he's taken the mark in the back pocket. So Bartlett making position towards the press box wing. Brown is down here as well. Yeah, Brown's probably have to it. come down the line, I would think. Tries oh, to uh, yeah. go around his opponent, gets a, a scrubby left foot kick away. Good tackling there by Mansfield. will lock it up 50 metres from goal. And uh, Bennett gets up. Herridge. Umpire throws it up quickly. The two could get the tap out. Quick uh, shot towards goal from Wheeler. Yeah, good mark. And a mark has been taken there. Uh, oh, by the man in the red boots. Oh. I think uh, that is going to be Willis, I Daniel reckon. Willis. Yeah, I think it'll be Daniel Willis. And uh, he has okay. taken a mark 25 metres out directly in front. OK, well, he's kicked the goal already. So, a uh, pretty reliable kick at goal, usually Willis. And uh, spends a bit of time in the midfield occasionally too. And a uh, pretty good footballer kick is on the way. And I think he's pushed that across nice. the face for a point. They've got the kicking yips a little bit here at Chuka, so mm. keeping the Eagles in the game. 2-9 is the score at the moment. Uh, Chuka and Mansfield fall behind. Uh, 17 yeah. points the difference yeah. there. Interesting, uh, last week too, I think they kicked very inaccurately. I think uh, that was about five goals, 16 or something, and a bit right. of a slog. So uh, could be a bit of an Achilles heel for the Achuka side. The kick comes in from fullback looking for Brown. He flies, gets his hands on the ball, but it goes over the boundary line. 70 metres uh, from goal. So a little bit of a respite for the defenders from Mansfield. Yeah, a couple of quick goals uh, would be nice. Yeah, a goal or two would be certainly make the game interesting. And... Uh, Morris versus Brown. Ball's on the deck. Pachuca forced the ball inside, attacking 50, running onto it nicely. Number 25. Check he's had a ping and he's missed as well. McHale, a point. Mm. So uh, that's their tenth behind. It is indeed. And uh, so three goals of difference now. Uh, they're ahead. Um, ten, ten behinds. I mean, that could have been all goals too, couldn't they? they? Could have. Jamie Sheen's kicked in from full back. His ball's gone over. Uh, his kick's gone over the battery line without anyone touching it. So a two could get the free kick. Left half forward. Kick comes in a full forward. Brown can be. Oh, come on. Up. And uh, he's been given a, yep. uh, yeah, awarded a free kick. Chopping the arms. So 20 metres out. Defensive goal square. He looks up the middle. All the players in one half of the ground. So he runs towards the members' wing. Kick goes in that direction, looking for Lawton. He's up and he marks this time. Almost unopposed. Little kick into the middle, looking for Jimmy Herridge. Jimmy Herridge who's taken a mark under pressure there. Uh, almost 50. Oh, Nothing fair. doing. So Jimmy Herridge, virtually in the middle of the ground. He looks towards the wing as well. And he's gone high out there to the uh, members' wing, but there's no one to take the mark. The two can get uh, on the loose ball. The kick comes back in and Herridge will mark it. Centre wing. And plays on immediately. Running uh, kick goes Missed towards everyone. half forward there. And uh, the Chuka defending well. We've got the ball at half back. And uh, players going to ground. Oh, the Chuka play a bowl over after he's disposed of the ball. They're on here at Chuka now. And they run That's through the centre square. McKenna. He goes into the pocket. Lockie Williams there with a fist for Mansfield. Uh, but it goes straight to an Echuca player who's tackled immediately by Bartlett and uh, will get a ball up. 25 metres out, directly in front. Echuca pouring the pressure on here, but uh, just not getting the ball through the big sticks. Brown goes down looking for Sheehan. He fires out a handball, but it's chopped off by Echuca. Another flying shot at goal. He's through for a point. Who kicked that one, did we see? I think it was uh, Willoughby again. Willoughby, was it? OK. Thanks. Yes, it was. This time uh, Sheehan comes in to Jack O'Grady, who's marked in the back pocket. 25, 30 metres from goal. Looks like he'll have to come down the line. Brown's at centre-half back, so uh, he didn't have an option this side of the ground, so he goes back to full-back. Williams is marked, and uh, he's got a player on at half-back. Howes. The well, umpire says 50 metres. Yeah. He was being held on to there. Good decision, I think. Yeah, Jaden House. So he'll come up towards the centre wing. And, uh, of course, everyone's got to get out of the way now. You can't run with the player. His kick goes towards half-forward. Brown's worked hard Ooh. to get the half-forward and uh, couldn't complete the mark, unfortunately, for Mansfield. So Echuca defending at uh, centre-half back. Kick from the ruckman there. 
Ward comes out to the wing, press Rick box is. side. Rick is there for Mansfield, battling hard against Willoughby. He's got him, yeah. And it's a lovely tackle, and the umpire yeah. says, I'll ball it up. So there you go. Yes. So well done to Jamie Rikers, but uh, ball up in shoeing, right in front of the super box here. Again, there's no ruckman for Mansfield. Rick but Rick is onto the loose ball. Left foot kick goes towards the centre wing. And uh, the ball's on the deck. And a uh, Chuka play there. Valentine happy to see the ball over the boundary line right in front of the scoreboard here. And the score, 2-11, 23, Chuka. It's a Mansfield four behinds. And we are at the 15-minute mark of the second quarter. Ward and Brown, centre wing. Press box side. Chuka have got the ball. A little clearance goes towards half forward. There he is again, Willoughby. Fires out a handball. Running through the middle of the ground there. Number 10. Left foot kick from Brock Kennedy goes to half forward. Yeah, but uh, back there again, Ryan Barlett marks. He's uh, had countless marks at half back today. Howes has got it. Half back flank. Gets off the mark now, looking for an option. Slowing the game down, the Eagles. So he runs towards the uh, members' wing. It's a strange old kick. Goes uh, looking for Foster. He couldn't complete the mark. Jacob Howes fires out a handball. But a Chuga onto the loose ball. They've got the ball forced, forced the ball forward to about uh, 70 metres from goal. High left foot kick goes inside, attacking 50. Bartlett under it for Mansfield. Couldn't get the mark that time. The ball's on the deck. A Chuga best place here. Handball comes over the top. Number 28, left foot kick goes into the goal square. Rika's mark for Mansfield. Mm -hmm. Well done, favoured by the kick there, Jamie Rikers. His left foot kick comes out to Andy Brown, who's gone oh. out the half back. He's dropped another mark. His handball comes over the top to O'Grady. He's taken immediately, and the ball is bundled over the boundary line. 70 metres around from goal. Right half forward for the Echuca side. As they attack uh, to the uh, netball end of the ground here. Boundary umpire tosses the ball back into play. Marton in the ruck goes looking for Anselmi. The ball spills to Marnie. His quick kick goes forward. And uh, nice mark there. And the switch of play is on to Lockie Williams. That was Gardner with the mark at centre half back. Williams looks into the middle. Mm. Ball. Marnie there. On back onto the loose ball. Has to quick kick it. And uh, almost marked by Anselmi. He uh, gets the ball going towards Sheehan. But an Achuka player chops. Off his attempt to uh, receive the ball, and his left foot kick goes out of bounds. So out of bounds on the full. Members wing. So again, Mansfield slowing the play down, but not being able to get any goals, Paul. No, at all. Um, well, maybe a couple of long, a couple of long bombs. I think uh, a few, few barrels. I think are, are in order. So Jamie Sheehan gets the ball to half forward, but uh, Chuga there to uh, bundle the ball over the boundary line. So right half forward, 60 metres from goal. Boys uh, at the can bar enjoying the sunshine. In it comes. Uh, neither Ruckman touched it with their hands. One touched it with his boot. She and he's tackled immediately trying to get the clearance. So we'll get a ball up. 70 metres from the Mansfield goal. Right half forward. Up it goes. Ward gets the tap out for a Chuka. No clearance yet. Foster almost got through the pack there for the Eagles. Forces the ball towards the boundary line. And a throw in. So uh, a bit of a lull in the play here. Not much clear footy going on. No. Uh, we've got the scores for them thirds. Uh, unfortunately, Mansfield went down 11-12, 78 to Chuka to 4-4, 28. Mansfield. Bit of a shame there. But, yes, um, they've, they've been competitive the thirds this year after a, a horrible year last year. So signs of improvement there from the young fellas. Mm. The ball's been forced into the middle of oh, the Rossi ground here. No. And uh, no free kick. Oh, uh, uh, Chuka fire the ball to the back of the contest. Good smother by Taz Klingham coming up on his opponent there. Oh, Bennett. Bennett. Klingham again. His oh. kick is smothered this time. Chuka have got the ball. Centre wing. They go towards half forward. Man out the back there all by himself takes the mark. It's uh, the big fella number eight. He goes to centre half forward looking for Willis. But uh, his teammates uh, got in front of him there and taken the mark. Willoughby again. It could be Willoughby. Man on actually. the mark is at 30 metres out directly in front. And it is. Number 62 yep. gets up with the mark, Sam, Sam Willoughby. Willoughby. So uh, he's a left footer. He'll uh, go back uh, almost to the centre square. And direct, directly in front, he crosses the 50 now on approach. 
Left foot drop punt is on the way. And again, I think uh, mm, Umpire does right. a bit of work, but I think he snuck that one through. So mm. finally they get a goal there, Echuca. Indeed, and the score now, Mansfield trailing by 25 points. Echuca 3-11-29, Mansfield 4 behinds. And the score brought to you by Henry III. And as Henry says, you think your job sucks. <laughs> and unlike the uh, first quarter... Paul, the game has been played primarily at Echuca's end of the ground, so uh, yes. and they finally right. uh, got some reward there for their dominance. Uh, back in the middle of the ground, Brad Anselmi's gone into the middle, opposed uh, to Darby Henderson. Josh Marton in the ruck for Mansfield. Neither ruckman can get a clear tap out. Taz Clingham's in there as well. So, uh, bringing the changes here, the Eagles, trying to uh, get some drive out of the midfield. Umpire throws it up again. Ward gets a tap out. It's shucked by a Mansfield player who's dragged to the ground immediately and can't get out of there. Jimmy Herridge. So uh, the third ball up in a row. Ward again gets a tap out. Clingham onto the loose ball. Fires it out. The back to Howes. Howes running towards the wing. He goes looking for Gardner. The kick is wide towards uh, the coach's box there and is uh, escorted over the boundary line by Tommy Gardner. So centre wing. Then beside of the ground. Ruckman wander over there to do battle. They lock up. Neither of them touch the ball. And what's the umpire paid here? Free kick going to Echuca. And a uh, bit of pointing going on. I think it's Darby Henderson taking the free kick. He looks uh, to switch the play initially. Then uh, kicks it down the line. And a uh, nice uh, mark there. Morris. Morris goes long to full forward now. Bit of a wrestle at full forward. The ball is on the deck. Willis can't get a handle on it. Uh, Lockie Williams fires out a handball to Jacob Howes up at uh, defensive 50. Rikers. Handball comes out to Rikers. Rikers goes uh, looking for the big fella there from Mansfield, number 44. He's having a quiet day. Half time of the net ball, fellas. Yes, mate. Uh, Mansfield 24 and each other won the quarter there 20. Oh, okay. Tight go there, go girls. So uh, Lawton unable to get a possession there. He's uh, jogged back to the goal square. The ball's out of bounds. Center wing. Scoreboard side of the ground. High throw in from the boundary umpire. Neither Ruckman touched the ball again. It's on the deck, uh, heading towards the boundary line. And Selmy with a right foot kick off the ground has uh, gone out of bounds on the fall. So uh, at defensive 50, Yachuka will get a free kick. So uh, right in front of the uh, playground here at the Rec Reserve, a little kick comes inside and a mark is uh, taken uh, there by Campbell. His kick comes to the wing. Ward, best place, flies from behind, couldn't get the mark. The ball is on the deck. Marton uh, sees the ball trickle over the boundary line in front of him. And a throw in right in front of the scoreboard. So a uh, press box side of the ground. And 23 minutes gone in the second quarter. So fast approaching half time here. Marton gets a tap out going for Herridge. He tries to bundle through, burrow through. And Selmy with a kick forward. Oh, Lawton comes out, but to the ball's evading him today. He gets it back again, has a flying shot towards goal. And it's going to bounce out of bounds, is it? No, no, it bounces back towards the goal and through for a behind. So a score to the Eagles. Indeed, it did a leg break, which was... Uh, Yes. <laughs> well, not enough. Not much of a leg break, but anyway. How's the World Cup going, Paul? Yeah. Oh, well, very good effort yeah, so far by Australia. We'll see how it all pans out. Very big, well. Big kick comes back in. Stefanuti flies. Reek is onto the loose ball. His kick goes inside, attacking 50. Lawton applying a tackle this time on his opponent there in Valentine. Oh, he said he pushed him. And uh, the umpire says it's a free kick. So it's going the Echuca player's way. So he's at uh, 20 metres... Out from his uh, defensive goal. Shield is shielding his uh, face from the sun. His kick comes out wide here. Uh, Rikers flies, unable to get the mark. Josh Marton goes to ground. Ball comes to the back of the pack. Howes there, there, tackled there. immediately by a flock of... of yeah. uh, <laughs> <laughs> a flock of bombers. bombers. A oh, squadron yeah. of bombers. Squadron, that's right. And we get a ball up. Centre wing, press box side of the ground. Marton <laughs> and his uh, opponent lock up there in the ruck. I think the umpire's paid a hold here and it's yeah. going to go the way of the Eagles. So Mart Josh Marton, he's got a player out wide and Will Foster. Mark's just inside the boundary line, right in front of the scoreboard here. He's a left footer, so he gets back off the mark. Thought about uh, playing on, but uh, now he'll drive the ball long. 
Looking for Brown. Gets inside attacking 50. Brown there with two to beat. Marnie sharks the uh, spoil. His kick is high to fall forward. Lawton Oof. flies, doesn't take the mark. And uh, Gardner down there applying a tackle. Well, mm. Actually, no, I think that might have been the uh, young fella in uh, Watson it was. Well done, young fella. So uh, 40 minutes out from the Eagles goals. Brown, <laughs> Brown gets rid of his opponent but uh, misses the uh, ensuing <laughs> rut tap out. Oh, gee. Uh, Turned himself inside out, doesn't yes. it? Yes. <laughs> and uh, the players dive on the ball and get another ball up. 40 metres out, directly in front of the Eagles goal. Oh, come on. There is. Brown that time taps it out, goes looking for she, and he can't pick it up. Foster back in there, or is it Herridge? He goes looking for Murray. Murray's tackled immediately by two Echuca players, including uh, Mitchell Kemp. And uh, another ball up 30 metres out from the Eagles' goal. So they've uh, locked the ball in fifth in the 50 for a while. Let's hope they can uh, snag a goal. Brown, clean possession out of the ruck. Gets a little left foot kick towards the boundary line. Marnie there, applying a tackle. Plenty of players around the contest. The umpire says, oh, ball it, all, ball it up again. So uh, 25 metres out. This time, uh, Echuca have forced it into the pocket. So from the right forward pocket... The umpire tosses it up, but uh, look at that. There's a yeah. there's 25 players around the contest. Finally, a kick off the ground comes outside 50. Yeah, he didn't have it. And uh, there goes yeah. the siren. The mercy rule has been invoked. Yes. And unfortunately for the Eagles, they were unable to capitalise on the, the last 10 minutes there, and uh, they didn't get a goal before half-time, Paul. Indeed, and half-time score now sees Mansfield trailing by 24 points. OK, keep us informed, Keith. All right, uh, starting of the third quarter here at uh, Recreation Reserve. Thank you, Paul. And the umpire throws the ball off in the middle of the ground. Brown, lovely tap out to Sheehan. Uh, he's bundled off the ball, though. Klingon picks it up for the Eagles. He's tackled immediately. Handball uh, is uh, fired out by Echuca. Foster gets the ball going forward for the Eagles. Mark taken at centre half forward by Anselmi. Man on the mark is uh, 40 metres out directly in front. So, Brandt Anselmi has... Uh, Gone back inside the centre square and we'll have a set shot at goal. So, uh, nice start uh, by the Eagles there getting a centre clearance. Brad Anselmi is on approach. He'll kick from about uh, 48 metres. There it goes now. The kick is high. Looks pretty straight. The umpire's doing a bit of work late. And uh, I reckon that's a goal. They've gone to him, so it's a goal to the Eagles. Well done. Indeed. Good start to Mansfield. Mansfield now trailing just by three goals now. So Mansfield 1-5-11 to the Chuka Bombers 3-11-29. And the scores are brought to you today by Henry III, your local liquid waste specialist. Liquid. Liquid. That's right. <laughs> and he's servicing Mansfield and surrounding areas. And in the AFL. The, the Demons have actually fought back. It's uh, eight minutes into the third quarter and uh, Frio are 41, Melbourne 40. Hmm, OK. So uh, middle of the ground again. Ward against Brown. Brown gets a tap out. Sheehan, Sheehan taken ball. high and the umpire saw it and he's going to yep. get a free kick. He pays advantage. Reek is onto the loose ball. Goes to centre-half forward. That's OK. The... Uh, the Chuka side uh, spoil there, get the ball over the boundary line. About 40 metres from goal, Jamie Sheehan picks himself up, a little worse from where, but uh, he's jogging over to the ruck contest now, so playing on ball this week, Jamie. Mm. Doing a pretty good job too. <laughs> and Howes just bundles past his uh, opponent there in the ruck, but he uh, couldn't get the uh, tap out. The ball has been forced over the boundary line again. Uh, 40 metres around uh, from the Eagles goal, uh, right half forward flank. They are taking to the netball end of the recreation reserve. That's a bit of throw in from the boundary umpire. Howes in ruck there for the Eagles. Gets it out looking for Murray. Howes butters up again. Handball to Sheehan. Sheehan fires out a handball to Klingham. Klingham goes high into the pocket. Out comes Lawton, but uh, his opponent there uh, had uh, the sit and knocked the ball over the boundary line there, Cameron Valentine. He heard footsteps, didn't he? Yes, he uh, certainly <laughs> knew he was coming, the oh, big fella. Yep. So Valentine smashes the ball uh, over the uh, fence. So uh, a couple of little fellas there go and retrieve it for the uh, boundary umpire. So he's uh, 10 metres around from the right point post. Tosses the ball back into play now. Howes in ruck again. Nearly Sheehan. The ball uh, comes out the back of the pack. There's plenty of uh, Echuca bombers there. They run it to defensive oh, 50. Gee whiz. Kick comes out to the centre wing. When it's on there. It looked uh, like a player got dumped after disposing yeah, of the ball. Well. The umpire says play on. They go inside attacking 50 now. Echuca. Mark's been taken Chuka there Mark. by uh, Wheeler. 
So uh, Rossi Brand man's a mark at 48 metres out, 30 degree angle. Wheeler, left foot kick goes in towards the pocket. Howes goes back with the fly of the ball courageously. Uh, couldn't complete the mark. He's got it on the deck, though, and applies a good tackle. Umpire says, give it to me, I'll ball it up, boys. Uh, 15 metres out directly in front. So a good a quick transition from the Echuca side. Brown gets the tap out, but it's Shark there by number three. Yeah. Shot on goal. And the umpire says it's a goal, so... Uh, Wheeler. Wheeler. It's a goal for the Echuca side. They answer quickly. They do indeed. Sees so uh, Echuca now 4-11-35, Mansfield 1-5-11. So uh, well done to the Eagles uh, from, for getting a goal, but Echuca uh, were able to respond very quickly yeah. and uh, have uh, restored their half-time lead. Mm. Yeah, that uh, Chuka player, uh, player got uh, floored. I'm not sure who hit him or pa- uh, bumped into him, but he went down like a bag. And uh, <laughs> it was on for young and old a little bit. For uh... The umpire kept the game going, which is probably yep. the best policy in most cases. That's Sheehan right. with a lovely handball to Marnie from the middle. Marnie goes long into the pocket. Lawton there battling one-on-one. He can't get the mark. Play on, says the umpire. And getting back there, Valentine. He's dragged over the boundary line. Play on. The umpire's a long way off the ball here. He, uh, he uh, gets down towards the contest now and I think it's a th- throw in a lot of gesturing going on in the pocket mm. might even be a ball up maybe it didn't trickle over the boundary line the players are all looking at each other umpire has got his arm in the air could be a blood rule perhaps yeah. no no okay. all fair play on it's a Nechuka free kick by the look of things so there must have been something happening off the ball there and uh, I think we've had a player sent off here. Looks like Brant Anselmi jogging from the field. Umpire held up uh, what appeared to be a card. Mm. That was a load of garbage, folks. <laughs> what <laughs> was it, Keith? You would have seen it. Keith's right there on the spot. He's actually dropping the ball against Echuca. Yeah. The umpire is so far away, he didn't see it. Uh, and... Uh, Nine and a half metres away from what it was, the incident. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Special comments then from uh, Thank Keith you, Rogers. Keith. <laughs> Thank you, they were special. They were very special. Yep. We'll cherish those, Keith. Well, it'll be on the videotape, so we'll uh, be able to have a look at that uh, during the week and see actually what happened. I'm sure you're right on it, Keith. Thank you very much. Uh, uh, Lawton's come up to man the mark, and uh, there's been a significant delay here yeah, while... Uh, I'm absolutely no idea what's going on, but the ball is uh, in the back pocket for Echuca, and Mansfield uh, appeared to be one man down. Long kick comes in there from the pocket, goes to half back. No one can take the mark. The ball is on the deck. Uh, Howes fires out a handball looking for Marnie. He's uh, dodging and weaving there. Goes backwards to go forwards. He goes to Rossi Brown. He goes back towards Marnie. Marnie onto it now. Handball over the top. Goes to Howes. Howes tries to crash through a tackle and uh, a gang tackled and onto the deck. And the umpire says you had prior opportunity, so it's a free kick to Wachuka. It's not bad. The three of them jumped on him yeah. and he uh, gets Grief. <laughs> so Wachuka uh, get the free kick. They're attacking side of centre wing on the uh, members' side of the ground. And uh, it might be Willis out there. It's a terrible kick inside attacking 50. And Marnie, the ball bounces in front of him, says the umpire, no mark. Mm. He claimed it. Uh, a couple of Echuca players jump on him, so we'll get a ball up uh, 45 metres out from the Echuca goal. Right half forward flank. Echuca attacking to the Memorial Gate end here at the Rec Reserve. Brown gets the tap out, but to no one in particular. And uh, there's a pack of players uh, have descended upon the pill. And so another ball up. Mm-hmm. 4-11, Chuka, Mansfield 1-5. Umpire tosses it up. This time Brown gets his hands on it. And uh, the Eagles uh, force the ball towards the boundary line and they gain a few metres there. So we're 60 metres around from the Chuka goal. Boundary umpire will toss the ball in right in front of the can bar. G'day to Tim and the boys over there. In it comes. Brown again wins the tap out, but again not directed uh, to any player. Kick comes forward there from Henderson from Chuka, and Rossi Brown gets back, takes a chest mark in the pocket. He oh, squares it up for O'Grady at full back, and uh, oh, a comedy of errors there. The ball is on the deck in the pocket. Chuka have a flying shot towards goal in the van here, number six. Uh, Allen couldn't take the mark, and uh, well done to young Watson, gets the ball over the boundary line. Yeah, Morris was there. He had a, he had a chance perhaps yeah. to kick his goal, uh, but uh, unfortunately it didn't happen. Yeah. Uh, so Dane, he didn't get a point, though. No, that's... Well, 
Dangerous kick across goal. Nearly came unstuck for the Eagles, but they fight on. Ball's directed down and uh, comes out to Sheehan. Sheehan goes to Clingham. Clingham looks into the middle. And uh, Achuka will be first to get there. Uh, number 62, Willoughby, is on the bottom of that pack. And the umpire circling says, I will ball it up. Right in the middle of the Rick Reserve. Up it goes. Brown wins the tap out. Guy Murray fires out a handball looking for Marnie. Marnie Marnie tangled out the ball and uh, no free kick. Brown picks Mm. it up again and uh, stacks on the mill in there. Sheehan battling hard for the Eagles. Forces the ball forward. Looks like Rikers, but he couldn't get a handle. And uh, Chuka defend towards the boundary line. They've kicked it towards the wing on the press box side of the ground. And uh, number 10 there fumbles the ball over the boundary line. Brock Kennedy for a boundary throw in. Right in front of the uh, electronic scoreboard here. And uh, our score is brought to you by Henry III. Your local liquid waste specialist. Thank you, Tone, wherever you are today. Yes. Ball uh, is thrown back in. Brown, lovely tap out. Clingham gets the ball going towards the wing. Herridge almost picked up the loose ball. Howes gets in there, tries to flick it out to Herridge. Marnie, handball to Brown. Here's a bit of a fumble, but fires it out to Rikers. Rikers with a kick inside, attacking 50. The ball's going to pitch just inside, attacking 50. Guy Murray tries to slap the ball onto Lawton. There's plenty of Echuca players back there now defending. And uh, a ball up 50 metres out from the Mansfield goal. Right half forward flank. And uh, the Ruckman are pointing. Yes, I'm in the Ruck. And uh, away they go. Battling hard in there is Rossi Brown forcing the ball forward into the pocket. Yeah, plenty of Echuca players back there. There's four or five of them there. Sheehan picks up the loose ball. Quick kick goes inside attacking 50. Yes. And this time the big fella comes out and mugs on his chest, Lawton. Lawton. So uh, 25 metres out, not much of an angle to speak of. So uh, finally a shot at goal uh, for the big number 44. Marks a spot on the ground, about uh, 25 metres out. Yep. Comes back off that now. Pretty well straight in front. Yes, we've got a perfect view of it here. Uh, A bit of a break for the rest of the players. The border boys are out there doing their thing. And Lawton. From starts his run up from uh, just inside the 50. He's on approach now. In he comes, right foot drop punt. And straight uh, through, uh, straight the, through the middle. And that's a goal to the Eagles. So uh, Mansfield hit back again. They do. Mansfield now 2 5 17 trailing. The Chuka Bombers 4 11 35. So that's 18 points the difference. or well, three goals. So. So, so I think the key here, Paul, is to make sure that uh, they can. Uh, Sort of just slow the game down again, the Eagles, and That's fight right. on. Don't let a Chuka quick get the quick answering goal. And right. uh, if they could uh, snag a goal or two, they'd uh, put the heat uh, back on the uh, Achuka side. Because it's not a very high scoring game, and um, yeah, I mean, again, Achuka's really the kicking it is, hasn't been that terrific. I have news. Go. You have news. It's certainly not fake. Oh dear. I'm afraid it blew out the wrong way. Mansfield um, 30, 36. Yep. I can't read my own writing. Right. And uh, it's Chuka 46. Oh, so thank you, Keith. Bad luck, no, girls. Shame. Good, no, well. good fight. Yep. Thanks, Keith, for bringing us uh, that update on the A-grade dead ball. Good on you, mate. Ball's back in the middle of the ground. Uh, Clingham fighting hard there for the Eagles. The fight's a draw there up against a, a couple of opponents, one of them being uh, Corey Gregg. Umpire throws it up, middle of the ground again. This time, Chuka get the tap out. They can't get a clearance, and a player has gone down there a little worse for the wear. He uh, gets to his feet now, McNamara. Game getting a bit willing. Oh, that's oh. got to be a free kick umpire. Yeah, and, I think uh, so. Kane Morris oh, there. Oh, that could be 50. Has just disposed of uh, that should be 50. Brownie. In fact, it is. And, uh, and he's given away a 50 <laughs> as well. So <laughs> Brownie gives him a bit of a... <laughs> Well done. <laughs> and uh, Behind the year. a fair bit of scragging going on the uh, far side of the ground. But uh, Brown comes up to attacking 50. Mm. His left foot, his right foot kick goes to Lawton, who uh, yep. leads out marks on his chest. 30 metres out. Bit of an angle, this one. So there's still a chance. But uh, he's a noted goal kicker. So uh, if he just uh, goes through his routine, again, marking the spot on the ground. So uh, probably a 45 degree angle. He's at left half forward this time. So the crowd uh, over there on the member side will have a perfect view of this. Uh, so so, we'll, we so should Keith. Keith should be able to Keith, talk yeah. this one through. You I'm ready, talking, Keith? I'm talking. Good boy. <laughs> <laughs> so Lawton comes in now. Crosses the 50. Right foot kick is on the way. Goal umpire doesn't move. Had a look, Keith. 
He's missed. He's missed. <laughs> he missed. Oh, oh my God. goodness. Oh. Maybe the goal umpire just got frozen in time. No, no. <laughs> it was cold enough. <laughs> Short kick comes into the back pocket mark taken uh, by Valentine. Playing a good game, good defensive game. The big fella at full back. His kick comes to half bank. Half back. Brown flies, but the mark has been taken by Bartlett. Mm, good mark. And uh, really showed his aerial skills off, and it's a 50 metre penalty. What was that for? I'm not sure. I think he might have been encroaching on the uh, protected area there. The bloke sort of ran across the mark, I think. He's uh, pleading his case with the umpire there, number 29, Peter Fawkes, but uh, nothing doing. Bartlett is marched. That is one hell of a 50 up towards. <laughs> is that, that's about. Well, that didn't fifty. <laughs> well, it's a seventy-meter penalty because he, he marked it at about seventy-five minutes out. Now the man on the marks inside the goal square. Okay, so it's Ryan Bartlett. Isn't yeah, it? Ryan Bartlett, number sixteen. In he comes now. Kick on the way, and uh, it's gone through for a goal. So the Eagles Keith, are back in this contest. I'm turning you off, Keith. <laughs> <laughs> Your eyes are failing. <laughs> We're straight through the middle. We can see that from here. So his glasses, mate. <laughs> here we go. He's going to blame his bifocals now. Okay. <laughs> I'd hate to be the goal umpire. I tell you, whatever happens so quick. Very good. Okay, score now. Uh, he's Mansfield 3 6 24 trailing the Chicka Bombers 4 11 35 and uh, 11 points of difference here. So another couple of quick goals. We'll see the, uh, the Eagles poke their noses in front. And that score brought to you are Henry the Third, your local liquid waste specialist. So well done to Ryan Bartlett back in the middle yes. of the ground. Uh, Echuca get the tap out uh, through Kane Morris. Ball is forced towards the centre wing. And uh, well done for the Eagles there for getting oh, two in a row. Nice. But a lovely handball over the top. And Echuca go inside 50. Number 15 running onto it in the pocket. And uh, good about. pressure by, uh, by... There might be Watson down there or Klinger. Klingham. And uh, it's gone out of bounds right next to the right point post. Echuca attacking... To the Memorial Gate end here at uh, the Rec Reserve. And uh, Boundary Empire. Well, Boundary Empire issuing a few instructions there too, so I'm not sure what all that's about. Hmm. Uh, throw in comes back in, taking clean possession out of the ruck is Allen. But uh, Mansfield have got the ball now. They uh, go out looking for Reekers. And. Uh, Ball bouncing around at half forward, left foot kick comes into the goal square, but the uh, Lockie Williams marks for Mansfield. He's got a player on wide in Gardner, who marks uh, 45 metres out from the Echuca goal. Al Bennett's on his own out here, so he should look uh, for Al, perhaps. He uh, squares the ball across to Marnie, still inside defensive 50. Marnie goes into the middle, but uh, misses the target. Uh, Sheehan runs onto the loose ball. Uh, he fires out a handball, and uh, it's worked okay. Finally, Rossi Brown runs onto it. His kick goes out to Howes, who's made some space at half forward. Howes runs to 55. He's got a one and one in front of him. Uh, uh, but yeah, Josh Marton uh, is under the ball and can't complete the mark. Kick comes out wide here. Brownie in the, in the van for the Eagles. Picks it up, goes around an opponent. Goes with a handball to uh. Guy Murray. His handball is chopped off. And away they go, uh, Echuca. And this is the Willoughby. young fella, Willoughby, bursting around the centre. He's had three bounces. Now he looks inside 50. Goes all the way to the goal square. Uh, cling him up for Mansfield. Doesn't complete the mark. The ball is on the deck. Lockie Williams pushes his opponent away. Well done. And uh, Clingham gets a kick back towards the wing. Will the ball pitch and go out of bounds? It's trying its hardest. They keep it in a chuga. No, it slips over the boundary line there, number 22. Ooh. Luke McKenna. And okay, that was, throw in. That was a, uh, a quick paced uh, <laughs> passage of play, wasn't it? Game staying to open up a little bit uh, here in the third quarter. Which is good. Boundary umpire tosses the ball back in. And uh, Kane Morris gets the ball down for a chuga, but uh, Sheehan gets a handball out. It's chopped off, though. And the Chuka go inside 50. Uh, Williams in position for Mansfield, but he can't complete the mark. The ball is on the deck. Uh, Chuka player can't run onto it there, number three. And uh, will it go over the boundary line? I think it will. 25 metres around from the Chuka goal. Left forward pocket. So uh, very uh, open passage of play the last five minutes. But... Uh, all players pushing up now to one half of the ground. It's a very, very shallow throw in from the boundary umpire. And Klingham runs onto the uh, ruck uh, tap out. He comes looking for Howes. He directs the ball down to Brown. The big fellow's combining well. Uh, Brown is back to Howes. Howes tries to get a handball to Guy Murray. Oh, yeah, they, oh, umpire, did you see that? <laughs> that was a, that was, he was foxing for a not 
for not for a free kick. That's right. Anyway, Howes butters up for the Eagles. Oh, that's yeah. high. A little bit of a high tackle. They flick the ball out to the wing at Chuka. They've got the players on inside 50. That's a lovely kick by yeah. number 23. And the yeah. mark is taken by Allen. Allen goes long to the goal square to a one-on-one. And uh, getting back a quick Ooh. shot at goal there. And the umpire says it was touched off the boot. Okay. And uh, I think that might have uh, been Henderson there with a shot at goal. Henderson, right. Okay. It was. So, yeah. score now, Chicka 4-12, 36, Mansfield 3, 6, 24. Two goals even. Two goal even difference. Jamie Sheehan yes. doing the kicking duties at full back. Probably Jamie's uh, best game for quite a while for the Eagles. Running back into form, he goes short to Marnie, centre half back. Marks in front of his face. Sun's a bit of a worry. Sun is a bit of a worry. Garden making position out here on the other side of the ground, but he goes down the member side towards the centre wing. And uh, under the loose ball there, lovely little uh, dummy by Rikers. Rikers goes down to Lawton. Uh, he's in a one-on-one. He wins the ball on the deck, runs to 55. He goes forward looking, looking for, for Brown, Brown, who's gone to full forward. Oh. And he doesn't take the mark. The umpire says, play on. And uh, they force it through for a behind there. Valentine doing a good job getting the ball over the boundary line. Brownie appealing for a free kick, but nothing doing. Kick comes into the back pocket. Yes, McKenna has marked the ball. He plays on immediately now. Chuka have got players out here. O'Callaghan goes backwards. And uh, they come towards the centre wing in front of us here. Mark is taken by Jordan Frew. He plays on. Henderson goes towards centre half forward. No mark taken. The ball is on the deck. Good tackle, Rossi Brown. Well done, Will Foster getting back there to help out. Brown again. Fires it out. Josh Marton. His handball's chopped off. And uh, Noah Wheeler tries to get through a few. And uh, another kick smother there. Great defensive effort by the Eagles. Jamie Sheehan drags an opponent down. The big fella, number eight, picks it up there. Kane Morris has a Point. shot at goal. But it's a... Oh, the umpire's getting involved. Three kicks gone to Echuca. 60 yeah. metres out. Might have been for Jamie Sheehan dragging uh, an Echuca player down without the ball there, I think. Oh, Almost got... a professional free kick. He's going to Morris. And, uh, is that Morris? No. I no, think it's, okay. Uh, McKenna, isn't it? Might be. Mah- 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 oh, no, 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 23, yeah. Mitchell Kemp. Yep. Kemp goes into the pocket. Howes will fly for Mansfield and takes a mark. Hope he hasn't uh, hurt his uh, knee there. He fell awkwardly after completing the mark. He gets up limping. Young Jaden Howes in the back pocket. Forced to play as a defender as the uh, numbers have dwindled for the Eagles this year. His high kick goes towards centre wing. Brown held out of the contest and uh, no free kick. And uh, it's a mark to a Chuka out there. And they go back inside 50. High towards full forward. Bartlett in... Uh, oh, got a got arm over the shoulder there, but no free kick paid. And uh, so a ball up is forced uh, 30 metres out directly in front of the Echuca goal. They are attacking to the Memorial Gates end. Jaden Howe's gone off. Yeah, I thought he might have to. And uh, stacks on the mill in there again. The umpire will probably have to ball this up. He's in the hands of the trainers over there, Jaden. Oh. So doesn't look too flush, actually. No, uh, the ruck tap back goes towards Rikers. He tries to run the ball out of 50, but his handball is astray. And uh, Chuka send the ball back into the pocket. And it's gone over the boundary line and out of bounds on the fall. So Lockie Williams gets the free kick. His uh, short kick comes in. Marnie comes up and uh, marks on his chest. He looks to switch the play. He's got a player on out wide. It's uh, Jamie Sheehan. And uh, Jamie Sheehan has marked 50 metres out on the other side of the ground. He goes down the line to Gardner, who takes the mark and should get 50. Well, I reckon he should, yeah, yeah. Yes, and the umpire's paid it uh, against uh, Brock Kennedy there. So Gardner picks the ball up and runs uh, towards the umpire. Of course, Kennedy can't go anywhere near him because he'll give away another 50. And uh, Gardner is uh, going to have a kick from about 55 metres out. So the uh, ball has transitioned uh, up to the netball end. He's holding the ball aloft. Looks like he's going to have a shot. It's going to have to be a long kick. He'll uh, kick yeah. from 55 in the blue boots. He, uh, in That's fact, goes short. short and uh, no mark has paid there. That almost mm. would be a free kick, I would have thought, for yeah, either back, over the shoulder or in the back. But, again, nothing doing in the pocket. No. Oh. And uh, a ball up. 
So 15, 20 metres out from the Mansfield goal in the right forward pocket. Lawton directs the ball down. No uh, Mansfield player can get a uh, clearance out of there. Lawton bowled over and uh, stacks on the mill. will get another ball up. Close to the boundary line, right forward pocket. And 23-minute mark of the third quarter here. So uh, fast approaching the three-quarter time bell. And uh, Mansfield uh, battling hard in the pocket. Uh, Achuka defending well. They forced the ball over the boundary line and out of bounds. In three-quarter time, uh, Melbourne 60, Fremantle 65. So oh, very tight go, tight go down there at, uh, I'm assuming that game's at the MCG. Go Ds. Boundary umpire tosses the ball into play. Lawton almost clean possession out of the ruck. He goes up, back and butters up. Uh, no free kick. Uh, plenty of players there, the umpire. Reluctantly blows the whistle and we'll ball it up uh, 20 metres out directly in front. So uh, oh. big Kane Morris there flies high. He gets a little tap out. But uh, Herridge onto the loose ball. He's in the pocket. Could he kick a miraculous goal? His kick goes towards full forward. All sorts of uh, carnage down there in the pocket. But uh, Achuka come away with the ball and um, oh. kick goes forward and has been marked there by Watson, I reckon that is, the young fella. Yep. So, uh, Nick Watson is 60 metres from goal, left forward flank. He just pops it up to the hot spot there, looking for Lawton to fly. And uh, no one able to take the mark. The ball on the deck. Achuka have got plenty of numbers around the ball. They flick the ball out the back. And then a left foot kick goes uh, towards yeah. the coach's box. Well, I think it's gone out of bounds on the full. So, Mansfield keeping the pressure on here. It'll be Breakers with the kick. Um... No. 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 What is going on there? I don't know. I've been touched. Very strange. I think there's been a free for off the ball. The, the uh, umpire off the ball is uh, having a fair bit to say to the players there. And the kick goes down the line. Bartlett flies again. And uh, he goes into the middle looking for Brown. But the kick misses him. And the ball is on the deck. Uh, Achuka arrive in numbers. Brown is uh, tackled immediately. He sort of rolled over there. Tackled, he was jumped on. <laughs> and uh, ball's in the middle of the ground. So uh, Brown will just smash it out of there. <laughs> he tries to get it towards the centre wing. But um, the Achuka players defending stoutly. There's a real arm wrestle in the middle of the ground there. Kane Morris involved. And another goal would be handy. Another uh, goal would be very handy. Eagles. Rossi Brown doing a terrific job there on Noah Wheeler. Uh, that's uh, dropping the ball umpire. Yeah, he has paid it against uh, Darby Henderson there. So free kick to Mansfield. Looks like Taz Klingon out there. Nice and long kick, Taz. That's what we need. And uh, oh, he goes towards the wing. He's uh, hit the target though and Will Foster has marked the ball. Gets back off the mark quickly in front of the interchange area. And uh, almost kicked it, but uh, take two. He does kick it now towards half forward. The ball will land at 50 metres out. Brown there, best place for the Eagles, but uh, Chuka defend the ball over the boundary line. So 55 metres around left half forward for the Mansfield side as they attack to the netball end of the rec reserve. 27 minutes gone. Mansfield trailing by 11 points. Uh, they're just keeping us uh, interested here, the Eagles. No uh, clearance from the ruck contest. Brown slaps it inside, attacking 50. Coming up, Howes, full chested. Handball goes out. And uh, that's Marnie. He comes outside 50, then hooks the ball back to full forward. Lawton's got two or three to beat. They punch from behind. Well, Achuka, the ball goes towards defensive 50. And uh, they've got a spare player on over the top. Nice little handball from Mitchell Kemp. Finds the target. Player on in the middle. And uh, this fellow's been very impressive. Willoughby is marked. Mm. He goes forward to a one-on-one. -on -one. And a uh, nice grab there by Willis. He played on. Definitely played on, umpire. But uh, no free kick. And uh, kick goes in from uh, Wheeler to the pocket. And um, it's out of bounds on the full, I think. Mm. No, he's no. going for it to be just thrown in. No, the umpire says, no, nah, pitched before it goes went over. So a boundary throw in. 25 metres around from the uh, left point post. Memorial Gates uh, end of the ground. Another very, very shallow throw in. The uh, field umpire says, no, you've got to do a bit better than that, son. So we'll get a replay. I'd like to see him throw the ball a bit higher still. Yeah. He's still throwing it flat and out. So when it comes now in the pocket, neither Ruckman touched it. Uh, Eagles play it in number eight. Morris was looking for a free kick, but nothing doing. Umpire says... Uh, 
Forget That's it. three quarter time. Indeed, indeed. So, a score, okay. please, Paul. Okay, Mansfield now trailing by 11 points, three quarter time. It's Chuka 4 12 36, Mansfield 3 7 25. Playing arena here. Okay, and, uh, here we go. At the MCG, the D's are in front by a point, 66 to 65. Go D's. Final quarter action here at GV Footy in Mansfield. And uh, the Eagles look to go forward. Brown with a handball out. Marnie to Sheehan. Handball hits uh, Foster on the back of the leg. Sheehan goes in again. Uh, his handball is chopped off on that occasion. And the uh, Pachuca Murray Bombers go forward to half forward. Rossi Brown leads back there for the Eagles. Can't get a handle on the ball in uh, front of uh, Darby Henderson. And it trickles over the boundary line. About 80 metres around uh, from uh, the Pachuca goal. And uh, they're attacking uh, to the netball end of the rec reserve here. Boundary umpire with a lovely throw in that time. Brown takes clean position. Quick kick goes towards the wing. Uh, no one able to pick it up initially. Howes has got a handball off. And Selmy left Ooh. it behind. Got uh, knocked off the ball. Great tackle by Howes. The umpire is going to reward him with a free kick. Yep. So uh, well done, Jacob Howes. has got a free kick centre wing. They all peel off. He looks into the middle. His brother's back on the ground, Jaden. Yeah. And he marks in the middle of the ground. Handball that goes out wide now. And Watson goes over the top. Bartlett running. Nice kick down to the half-forward line. No mark taken. And Rikers, Rikers gets the ball inside 50. Very close to the boundary line. And it goes out of bounds about 30 metres around from the right point post. OK, 4-12-36. Echuca 3-7-25, Mansfield. And uh, the roving uh, reporter has joined us here in the box. Keith, good to see you, Keith. Where's that hat? Oh, it's been sure. having a... Uh, Terrific time down at the netball. Unfortunately, no uh, netball results went the way of the Eagles today. Mm. Uh, Chuka defending stoutly, get the ball to uh, the wing on the members' side and uh, escorting the ball over the boundary line there was uh, Jamie Rikers. So we'll get a uh, throw in right uh, in front of the Mansfield coaching box. Bit of a crowd over there at the bar. Brown with a tap out, goes to the back of the pack. Echuca play a drag down immediately, but uh, the uh, ball pings around and uh, they go forward again. Echuca coming up, Bo Grady marks on his chest. Good uh, concentration there. His little kick goes into the middle. Taz Klingham has got it. So uh, he's marked uh, just inside the centre square, slightly the uh, member side of the ground. So uh, they're doing a good job here today, the Eagles. It goes towards the wing. This time looking for Anselmi. He couldn't get the mark. Onto the loose ball. Guy Murray kicks the ball high towards half forward. Lawton goes up. Well, drops a it. mark yeah. that uh, perhaps he should have taken. The ball's on the deck. And uh, the umpire circling says, I'll ball it up. 40 metres out directly in front of the Mansfield goal. Uh, Ruckman lock up. Howes there. Directs the ball behind the pack. Looking for Herridge. And uh, Chuka play goes to ball, goes to ground there with the ball. So we will get another ball up, 40 metres out from goal. Morton there hands the ball back to the umpire. Gets up uh, looking to do the ruck duties. Now it's Howes, he flicks the ball down. The Chuka player couldn't get a uh, clearance. This time Sheen gets a handball out. But uh, there's, uh, it's uh, partially smothered. It comes Herridge. to Herridge on 50. His handball is wide. He uh, goes chasing it after himself. <laughs> And uh, <laughs> and it's gone over the boundary line. I don't think the umpire is going to pay a free kick here again. There's a bit of push and shove over in the pocket. And uh, he has paid a free kick now. And uh, it goes uh, to Echuca. Short kick comes across the ground. And uh, mark taken by McKenna. He handballs off to a running player. They've switched it to the other side. And uh, it's a terrible kick coming out of there. And Selmy chops it off. He runs to 50 and goes to the pocket. He's got a player out there. And it looks yeah, like Rikers has come up and taken the mark. So uh, Jamie Rikers will have a shot uh, on goal from about to 25 metres out, virtually directly in front. And uh, he's walking back, holding the, hand, the ball uh, in one hand, Anthony Kutafidi style. Now he turns and uh, assesses his task. So he's walked back to uh, 50. Be a uh, big boost for the Eagles if they could get this goal. Breakers comes in. On his way now. Right foot drop punt. Goal umpire wanders over, but uh, the players are happy. And it's a goal. Well done to Jamie Rickers. That sees Mansfield now 4-7-31, just five points. We'll <laughs> look at it. Here comes the 7-4-7. Seven, seven. 
<laughs> Mansfield 4, 7, 31, and uh, Pichuca Bombers 4, 12, 36, so that's five points, the difference. So we're tough to uh, believe it's only a five-point ball game here. Uh, Echuca dominated um, the second quarter, just didn't uh, put enough scoreboard pressure on. The Eagles have played a very disciplined brand of footy and uh, right back in the game now. Indeed. So, and... Um yeah, Rick is, uh, that was his uh, first score, so good on you, Jamie. And uh, the Ruckman do battle in the middle of the ground. Uh, the Eagles try to get a clearance through Howes, who's come up from the back line. He fires out a handball to Foster. Good work uh, again from Brown there, providing a shepherd, but the ball goes over the boundary line, centre wing on the fall. So uh, the uh, Echuca side will get the resulting free kick. Only a five-point ball game here. Plenty of time left. Kick is high, and... Uh, Lockie Williams does a good job getting in there for Mansfield. Uh, gets the ball on the deck. Rossi Brown uh, pushes his Echuca opponent off the ball. And uh, we get a boundary throw in right in front of the super box. So uh, see how the boundary throw in goes. Again, it's a bit shallow. Brown onto it there. He uh, takes clean position. Got a high tackle. No free Ooh, kick. But uh, they force the ball out. Mansfield. Sheen with a lovely handle to Foster. As he's tackled, he gets his kick away. Stefan Nudy there couldn't complete the mark. The ball is on the deck. Echuca have got spare players in the middle. They flick it around with hands. Up comes Watson for the Eagles. It just interrupts the Echuca play enough, and we're going to get a ball up right in the middle of the ground here. So poor old Andy Brown there was... Oh, no. <laughs> his head ripped off. So uh, the uh, umpire was blindsided at this end of the ground, but I'm sure his uh, partner in crime should have been able to spot that. Brown gets a little kick out of the ruck contest. Echuca fire the ball forward again, and uh, here he is. Yeah, Willoughby. Willoughby. Smooth moving left footer. He goes to half forward. And uh, the ball is at the back of the contest. No one able to take Morris the mark. Trying. He uh, goes with a handball, but it's chopped off by Mansfield. And uh, a handball down the line goes out of bounds. A player down there holding his leg uh, looks in significant trouble. It's an Echuca player. Can't see who it is from here. Gets up slowly. Might have been Morris, Probably actually. Might have been Morris or Allen. No, it's Morris. Back on his feet now, anyway. Brown does the ruck uh, duties. Chuka player there does the fend off. Good tackle, Taz Klingen, but uh, no free kick, says the umpire. So ball up 50 metres out to, from uh, the Echuca goal. Andy Brown with the tap out. Echuca uh, get the clearance this time. They go into the pocket and uh, unable to keep the ball in play that time was Darby Henderson. In fact, uh, he didn't cross the line. The umpire says, I'm going to ball it up. Very close to the boundary line, 20 metres around from the point post. A defensive ruck, a tap out goes uh, very close to the boundary line over there. And uh, plenty of players around the contest. The umpire intervenes again and he'll have to ball it up. Here he goes. Brown with the tap out. No one able to get a clearance straight away. A Chuka player picks up the loose ball. He's quick kick the full forwards marked by Williams. Williams bangs it on the boot straight away. Goes straight up the middle of the ground. A Chuka player's uh, dropped the mark there. Herridge gets involved for Mansfield. And he's, and off. he's off to the races. He's got a player running out wide in Breakers. Playing a good game, Breakers. Gets through a tackle. Has a kick towards centre half four, yeah. but there's nobody home. And uh, chopping it off is Mitchell Kemp. He's got a player on, so he squares the ball. Now they look up the middle. It's a dangerous kick. Oh, but a terrific a mark. mark. Yeah. Cameron Valentine has marked it. Just defensive side of the centre on the point of the goal, uh, point of the centre square. Some becoming a bit of a problem now as it sinks away over there. So he squares the ball. Luke McKenna goes across the ground to Mitchell Kemp, taking a bit of heat out of the game now. Echuca. Centre wing they go. Members side of the ground. Mark taken out there. Little left foot kick comes forward. Foster gets involved for Mansfield. She in there. I'll try and do a pick up the loose ball. The Chuka uh, player gets involved in front of him. And uh, Jamie Sheehan wraps him up in a good tackle. So the umpire will ball it up. Between the wing and uh, the centre of the ground on the member's side. So uh, neither team able to score in the last five minutes. Brown tries to back out of there with the ball. But he's tackled, and the umpire says, I'll oh, ball it up again. 4 12 36, Pachuca, 4 7 31, Mansfield. So, five point ball game here. Pachuca try to get the ball forward, but Ross Brown there fires out a handball for Mansfield. They kick the ball down the line, the Eagles, and the ball goes over the boundary line right in front of the coaching staff there. 
Uh, players reposition themselves. Boundary umpire will throw it in. Ward and Brown doing the battle there. Brown tries to <laughs> smash the ball forward again. He hasn't, quite, few of those, hasn't isn't quite timed it perfectly yet. Uh, Willoughby kicks the ball forward for the Echuca side, but uh, lucky Williams marks. He's uh, done a bit of a helicopter kick coming out here looking for Watson. The ball won't bounce for him. Uh, He's got a player on in support, but the handball missed the target. And uh, going to get yeah. a free kick here, the Eagles. A bit lucky there, I think. Yeah, a little lucky, the young fella there. The ball just wouldn't sit for him, but he... Uh, he concentrated, got the tackle, and uh, now he's got a player on in the middle. He goes to Jack O'Grady, centre half back. He goes over the top, Lockie Williams. Getting plenty of touches out there at half back. He goes out to Howes. Howes sells a bit of candy, runs around his opponent, then he goes long to half forward. Brown's down there, surely, oh, umpire. Gee whiz. Oh dear. And sell me onto the loof ball, goes to full forward. And uh, good defensive work there by the uh, Achuga side. They force it through yeah. for a point. No, I think it was out of bounds. Post. Oh, hit the post. No, it's a point. A point. All right, okay. Umpire waves the flag, so it's a four-point ball game. Quickly in from oh, yeah. fullback come Achuga. So they're in the uh, left back pocket on the member side of the ground. Mansfield applying a lot of pressure now. Just need to uh, concentrate here. And uh, make the most of their opportunities. Rikers flies at the centre wing position. Gets the ball over the boundary line. Opposed to an Achuka player there. And uh, throw in right in front of the coach's box again. And uh, a bit of a strange one. That looked like a free kick in the marking contest to poor old Brownie. But uh, you don't get much if you're a big fella in the GV. Rossi Brown sharks it. And he goes forward. Nearly a mark taken there by the Eagles. They're flicking it a ball around. Rikers... Uh, tries a handball. Not sure whether that's Watson or Stephanie down there. In fact, it might be Josh Mart on it yeah. is. Gives the ball back to the umpire. And the Ruckman lock up at centre half forward for Mansfield. A high kick from an Echuca player comes back into the middle of the ground. Taz Klingham great, playing a good game. Mark. has taken the mark on his chest. He's about 70 metres from goal. And uh, Echuca player on the deck there. Doesn't look too well. Cleam goes long. Inside attacking 50. It's not a great kick. Oh. And Selmy flies. No mark taken. He butters up beautifully. Gives the whole ball out to Herridge. Shugs his way through a tackle. Goes back to Rikers, who has a fly to a goal. Oh, and it's going luck. through, but it's marked on the line there by yep. Luke McKenna. They play on quickly at Chuka, And uh, they come out to Mitchell Kemp, who's marked in the back pocket. They're defending very well, uh, the Chuka yeah. boys. Nice little kick over the top, marked uh, by the impressive Sam Willoughby. Number 62. He's still on defensive 50. His kick is on the way now. Brown in best position for Mansfield. Can't take the mark. The ball is on the deck. Well done, Jimmy Herridge. Burrowing in there. Bennett, kick off the oh, ground. Oh. That might work. It's going to pitch inside the boundary line and go out of bounds. 45 metres from the Eagles' goal. That was fortunate. I thought, my God, that's going out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. So, uh... It'll be the big fella there, Kane Morris, doing the ruck work uh, for Echuca. Looks like uh, Jacob Howes for the Eagles. Boundary umpire. Again, another shallow throw in. Pitches in front of the ruckman. Uh, and uh, well done, uh, Tim Allen, getting through there. But a kick goes forward from Mansfield. And Jamie Rikers has uh, unfortunately yeah. given away a free kick in the marking contest. And uh, it's a free kick to Trent Campbell. It's got a little... Player on out wide, back pocket, member's side of the ground. They've trapped in here, Echuca. They haven't been able to get out. It's a dangerous kick. It comes across goal. It's a two-on-one if the Eagles can get there. Gardner with his pace. And uh, will he get a... No, oh, the umpire has paid a free... He's a long way, a long way off the contest. He's paid a free kick against Mansfield. Yeah. And uh, Echuca square the ball to full back. So uh, they're really struggling to get the ball out of their defence here, Echuca. This time they're uh, in good position, but uh, they can't complete the mark. Gardner on the loose ball goes looking for Howes, but uh, the handball misses the target. And uh, it's going to be all hands to the wheel here if the Eagles can uh, get over the line. Willoughby at the bottom of the pack. Brown in the ruck. Battled hard all day. 
Neither Ruckman even went for the uh, rack tap out there. They were just content to lock it up. Jimmy Harry surely will get a free kick on this occasion. He does. And he plays on him immediately. Wheels onto the right boot. He goes looking to the big fella at centre half forward. No mark taking the ball. He's on the deck. And Selmy fires out a handball there, but he missed the target. And uh, Chuka player left the ball behind. Howes battling hard. Bennett tackled without the ball, and I think he's going to get a free kick. And so he should. He was, he was in there. Yeah. He, you know, he's the only one actually going for the ball. So here we go. Al Bennett's going to have a shot at goal. Man on the mark is 25 metres out directly in front. So uh, number 47 on his back. This would actually put the Eagles in front. Mm, Unbelievable indeed. turnaround in this game. So Al Bennett has gone back uh, almost uh, to the centre square. Very slow approach. In he comes now. Right foot drop punt. He stabbed at it, but he loves it. It's a goal. And the Eagles are in front. What a fantastic effort. And the Eagles now 5-8-38 leading the Echuca Bombers 4-12-36. Score brought to you by Henry III, your local liquid waste specialist servicing Mansfield and surrounding areas. And 20 minutes into the final quarter and Melbourne 79, Fremantle 71. So okay. the D's are looking the goods down there. And Mansfield looking the goods here at the moment. Mansfield are in 16 front. 16 minutes into the last quarter, so uh, halfway what? through, I'd say. Righto, back in the middle of the ground. The umpire tosses it up. A nice ruck tap out there by... Uh, Echuca, mm. free kick has been paid, Echuca play on, they force the ball towards 50, kick goes inside, attacking 50 now from Willoughby, and uh, the big yeah. uh, Ruckman's gone Ward. down there, and he's marked it at centre half Jobby, forward. Jobby Ward. And uh, that time uh, Bartlett couldn't get the ball on the deck, and he's marked it 40 metres out directly in front. Mm. So Echuca looking for a quick response here. Number 31, trots in, kick on the way, and... Uh, he likes it. It's pretty good. So uh, Achuka back in front here. It's a goal. Indeed. So sees Mansfield now. Four points behind once again. Mansfield 5-8-38 to Achuka. 5-12-42. Well, there you go. So a uh, very... Uh, a quick answer. Very quick answer from the Achuka side. So Mansfield must re-answer now. We must uh, respond. respond. So Correct. In the middle of the ground, uh, Sheehan's gone up onto the ball. And uh, just having a look to see who's gone in there with him. Taz Klingon's in there and Jimmy Herridge. So uh, the umpire's uh, just slowly putting the ball back into the middle of the ground here. This guy's struggling. And uh, he does look a bit weary. Tosses it uh, to the central umpire. Jogs down to his point on the square and uh, everything looks in order, ready to go. So the umpire tosses it aloft. Brown goes up, left hand, lovely tap to uh, Sheehan. He fires out a handball to Klingon. Oh. And uh, he goes over the top to Reek. He's having a great game out there on the wing. He goes long to half forward. Lawton is pushed off the ball yeah. and uh, nothing doing. And uh, Echuca forced the ball over the boundary line about uh, 40 metres out from the Mansfield goal right half forward flank. He's targeted every game, isn't he? Yeah, it's a very tough Lawton. gig playing at full forward. Uh, you're up against two or three opponents on a lot of occasions. Uh, Chuka get a, the ruck tap out on that occasion. They run the ball towards the centre wing. Up is uh, Watson for the Eagles. He uh, kicks the ball quickly back inside at uh, 50, but uh, Mark is taken by an Echuca player there, throwing his arms around. That's Morris. Morris. It's a bit of a hothead, that bloke. And uh, now he's going to... Now, a, now a there's a 50-metre penalty, and uh, I think it... Uh, the umpire's pointing towards Jamie Sheen. He might have said something to him there. Not sure. So uh, brings him right up to centre wing. And Morris drives it long. Inside attacking 50. Left half forward. And uh, a Chuka player runs onto the loose ball. He's hard up against the boundary line. He centres the ball back inside. And uh, a good mark taken by Tim Allen. And uh, he's probably about 35 metres out. Not much angle to speak of. And uh, Jamie Sheehan stands the mark for Mansfield. Melbourne have kicked away, 85 to 71 now. Mm. And it's the 25 minute mark of the final quarter. 
so shot on goal coming up for Tim Allen. Very slow approach. Inside 50, man on the mark, 30 metres out. Kick is on the way now. It's a wobbly old drop part, but I think it's straight and it's through the middle, so uh, Achuka look like uh, they've steadied the game, steadied uh, nicely here uh, halfway through the final quarter. 6 12 48 Achuka, Mansfield 5 8 38. And the score is brought to you by uh, Henry the Third. And Henry says, Henry says, our business stinks, but it is picking up. Yes, very good. Very good. I wonder if Tony actually says these things when he's driving along in that big truck. Of course he does. Probably does. Yeah. Well, he says all these things, so yeah. one would assume that he's always saying it to so, everyone. So Lawton has come up to do the ruck duties for the Eagles mm. as uh, the umpires get the ball back uh, into the middle of the ground. Uh, Brown. Brown's gone to full mm. forward. So uh, pretty quiet day for, for Lawton. So uh, hopefully he can uh, provide them with a bit of drive from the middle. He'll be up against... Uh, Kane Morris, I think, who wins the ruck tap out. Achuga get a centre clearance. Uh, torpedo out of the middle over the top of Williams. Running back onto the loose ball. Willis will knock it through for a point. I think he missed it. He missed it. Unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah, Willis point. Directly in front and he's kicked it through for a point. Marnie has gone down to kick in from a uh, full back. He comes out to Lawton, who's made position here. And he flies. He can't complete the mark. The ball is on the deck. And Achuka go forward again. This time, number 18 fires the ball into the pocket. O'Kelligan. O'Kelligan and a lovely mark. Good mark. And uh, I'm not sure whether that's uh, Willis. No. Got oh, the red, could be Got the red boots on. Very well, yeah, it could be Willis. And um, the man on the mark is only 20 metres out. So, yeah, it is n- a number five, Daniel Willis. Mm. So uh, put down your glasses, you, you'd think. It's a pretty good shot on goal. Mm. He... Uh, has backed off to about 40 metres out. Using up his full 30 seconds, in he comes now. And uh, the kick is on the way. And uh, goal umpire says that's pretty good. Yeah. Puts up the two Dukes, another goal to the Yachuka Murray Bombers. Who now go to 7.13.55 men, to Mansfield's 5.8.38. 17 points the difference now. 17 points of difference. Yeah. So, uh, what looked uh, very promising just a few, two minutes few gone. minutes ago uh, is looking very unlikely now for the Eagles. Yeah. But uh, they put on a good effort today and they put on a good show for their supporters. So I think the coach will be pleased with, uh, certainly I know he will be pleased with their effort. Well, they're playing against uh, you know, one of the top sides. That's so right. Who haven't, uh, have only lost one game for the season so far. So, Yeah, with all the players they've got out, it's been a good performance. Yeah. Uh, the guys next door in the Superbox have certainly enjoyed their afternoon. They have. And uh, tap out. Player fends off there, but no free kick. And uh, get a repeat ball up right in the middle of the ground. Up uh, goes for the umpire. Brown's back in the... Right. Yeah, Sheehan. Fires out a handball. It's chopped off by an Achuka opponent. They go back inside attacking 50 Achuka. And uh, Lockie Williams uh, punches f- the ball uh, forward for Mansfield. But there's plenty of Achuka players there. It's uh, one-on-one as they go inside 50. Oh, Bartlett. Um, if that's not a free kick, I, I've never seen a game of football in my life. <laughs> but uh, the umpire's going to ball it up. And uh, it's uh, 25 metres out from the Achuka goal. Quick uh, shot goes towards full forward. A Mansfield player goes to ground trying to get it over the boundary line. And uh, they force the ball into the pocket again at Chuka. Rika's there high, just uh, punches the ball towards the boundary line. And it's all at Chuka here in the dying moments of this game. Shot on goal from number 20. He's on the way. He's, he likes it. And he liked it. Corey Gregg has kicked the goal. So they're piling them on here now at Chuka. Finishing very strongly and now sees Chuka 8 13 61 to Mansfield. 5-8-38. It's 23 points the difference now. And uh, we're, what are we in now? About 20 minutes gone into the last quarter. So, uh, unfortunate uh, the result uh, appears to be beyond the Eagles at the moment. It's full-time at the uh, Melbourne game, and uh, they have won 85 to 71. So, 14-point victory there These. to the Melbourne Demons over the Fremantle side. Well done, Dees. Just need Geelong now to give Port Adelaide a big touch-up tonight. Ooh, let's hope so. Mm. Back in the middle of the ground, Barney gets a high tackle and gets a free kick this time. 
So he'll uh, have an opportunity to get the Eagles going forward. And Herridge provides him with a lead. That's ignored. He goes long. Looking for Brown, who's drifted down there. But again, they spoil well from behind uh, Echuca. The ball's on the deck. Rikas runs onto it. Has a bit of a stumble. His handball is chopped off by an Echuca player. I think that's Watson out there doing a good job, the young fella for the Mansfield side. And uh, ball up. Centre wing, member side of the ground. Unfortunately, most of the sting has gone out of the game. Uh, Echuca kicking the last four goals. And uh, that's got to be a free kick umpire, and it is. Tim Allen there trying to barge through the pack. No disposal. <laughs> Brown is giving him a shove. Andy Brown's getting a little frustrated with goings on, and uh, there's a little scrimmage out there at half forward. He goes into the... Umpire's bringing it umpire back. Umpire is making him kick it again. Yeah. So not sure what's going on here. Looks like it might be Reekers with the free kick. That's probably the uh, decision. Uh, very uh, crowded forward line. Rikers goes high. Howes comes out. Plenty of Echuca players there. One of them claimed the mark. Nothing doing since the umpire play on. They go to the full back line. A fantastic effort there. So the umpire saw that. The, uh, umpire. Morris has gone power with his uh, right hand right hand and floored. Looks like Ross Brown. I'm not sure. I was watching the ball. Yeah. And uh, a player has been sent off. A card being held up here again. Yeah, that, that's a Morris. He's a hothead, the bloke. Ah. The big fella, Cade Morris. Yeah. He's been ejected from the game. He's all arms and legs. And I suppose he, you know... He ah. flings his, his, his body around like that. He's uh, bound to hit something. So uh, we're assuming here that this is going to be a free kick to uh, Mansfield and a shot on goal. Yeah, could be Rossi. Oh, no, uh, Jamie Rickers, is it? Uh, might be Rossi, Rossi Brown. I think no, it is, is Ross Brown. Yeah. He yeah. looks a bit dishevelled. He's hair, he's, he's, yeah, he uh, copped it right in the side of the head. Yeah, right. OK, so uh, it's a tough cookie, Ross Brown. And he's just turning his back to the umpire so uh, he can show him the number. So, uh, I'd say assume, be a report assuming he's there. been reported there as well, yeah. as well as being sent off. So, he hasn't had a good day at all, has he, uh, Morris? <laughs> Four <laughs> points, and uh, yeah, he's, he didn't kick very well, no. and uh, now he's been reported and sent off the ground. So, Ross Brown will have a shot at goal. Man standing the mark is uh, 25 metres out, not much of an angle. So, uh, hopefully, Ross can slot this one through. He's uh, had a good game today, Ross. He's done a tagging role, played a lot of, spent a lot of time on Wheeler. His kick is on the way. Goal that's umpire good. just looks up and says, that's a goal. So well done to the Eagles. They're still fighting on here. 17 minutes, uh, 17, 17 points difference now. And uh, Mansfield, <laughs> Mansfield go to 6 8 44, trailing the Chuka Bombers 8 13 61. And we are 27 minutes into the last quarter, so I'd say the sign is not far away. Not too far away, but uh, anyway. Brownie just giving uh, Ross Brown there the, the low five in the middle of the ground for a job well done. And uh, there's a lot of chat between the umpires and the players, and uh, there's an umpire's uh, official here watching the game rather intently from the boundary line, so... Be interesting to think what he thinks about it. But uh, back in the middle, Brown goes up. He can't get the tap out. And uh, Ross Brown applies a tackle that time to an Echuca player. Gets him on the deck. And so another ball up right in the middle of the ground. This time Echuca get the tap out. Uh, Guy Murray uh, runs over the ball for the Eagles. There goes the siren. You're a spot on there, Paul. And uh, Echuca have taken the points here. They have indeed. Echuca 8-13, 61 have beaten Mansfield, 6-8, 44. And the umpires are getting a bit of uh, stick here from the boys next door in the box. Uh, they get together and uh, wander off to their rooms. And um, the players are just uh, shaking hands. Uh,